What's going on, everybody? I am sick as a dog. Woke up today feeling like crap. And guess what? We're not slowing me down. We're streaming. So if I sound like crap, it's because I feel like crap. Coral Island. Big chillin'. I love my wife. I forgot to turn my headphones on. Hold on. I had a dream about you last night. No, not a nightmare. Ha ha. It was a good dream. Is that why the bed was wet this morning? Plumbus looks happy today. Good Plumbus. It's windy today. So yeah, if anybody was here for the uh, last Coral what do you want? Lee, morning. Good morning. Uh, ah, yes, that is, that is. I am always, in fact. Love to stay and talk, but I'm kind of in a panic. My dog, Taco, is missing. Not Taco! Have you seen him? Oh, okay. Would you keep an eye out for him, please? Taco loves going on adventures, but he usually goes home at the end of the day. He's a mountain dog. Came up from there, actually. Just followed Suki and sort of lives down here now. Man, look out. Thank you. I'm just worried he might get lost. Maybe he went home. Back to the mountain. If he did, then I'd be glad. As long as he's safe. Anyway, I should probably leave. Take care. You should check on Luke at the vineyard later. Okay. We will check in with Luke later. So yeah, if you guys uh, were here for last week's stream, you would know that I got absolutely cheated out of my... Uh... These things are finally those ready. Um, cheated out of my... Harvest Festival win. That's a double crop. Double, double crop. Give me some crops. Imagine my inventory is not full yet. All right, we are going to press on. Give me the mega planes. Now my inventory is full. Now my inventory is full. All right. Let's see. I want to see what one iridium bok choy does. That's all that, that's all that, that's all that. I'll keep all that. Sell all that. Grab some more egg plants. My cranberries are now going to grow at different speeds, which I hate. The blessing thing was cool, but now it has cursed me with an uneven grow pattern, and I hate it. Um. There's literally nothing I can really do about that now. So we are stuck. That's what we got. Added more to our already insane list of grow. Uh, we'll have to get some more uh, seeds here. It's okay. So we got that. What the heck was this again? I think that was tarot reduce. Got one. Sake. Yeah, being uh, being sick is terrible, dude. Hate it. I'll just make some of that. Yeah, cause then I gotta run the run the gambit of do I call off work tomorrow when I called off work uh, a few days ago. My job's pretty cool about it, as long as you got PTO, which I have plenty of PTO. I really just don't want to go into work sick and get anyone else sick. Thankfully, I'm mildly sick, so it's probably just a cold. I'm more annoyed than I am anything else. It's really, really annoying. Set all the aminals out. It's like, I just want to feel good, man. 
I know it's also happy Easter to anybody who celebrates Easter. Um, I obviously do not. I hope you all have a good day. But if you're like me and you don't really celebrate and you don't have anybody to really celebrate with, I, uh, I welcome you. We can hang out together and we'll have a, we'll have a good day. We're going to kind of go crazy today uh, in terms of uh, the grass. We're going to try grassing up a ton of the farm today. I think that's kind of a big goal of mine. Get it done before winter. That'd be cool. Sounds like he's going crazy out in the woods room. I don't know what he's doing, but he's doing something. Womp. 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 I said womp. I said womp. Thank you. Yeah, we balled out. We got 190,000 right now, dude. We're, uh... We're pretty... Pretty well stacked right now in terms of money. Let's get some more seeds. Um, we're starting to hit the point where we're going to have to start paying kind of close attention to what's up with our time. Could do some more basil. Um, garlic wasn't too bad. Um, really don't want to do another flower. Have I planted artichoke? I don't think I did. I don't really want to plant another one like that that like produces every few days because I feel like we're not gonna get as much from it. Uh, kind of this this late in the season. Uh, we should probably do some more garlic. I mean, it's nine days, which is kind of a pain in the butt. I'll just do some, I'll do some more beets. I just bought one more than I needed. Sure, I'll just cancel. I oh, I should have bought grass squares as well. Oh yeah, my cat is in gremlin mode. I found one of his favorite toys was kind of tucked up somewhere, so I rescued it for him. He was like staring at it real bad, and I was like, what are you doing, dude? Like pop my head under, I was like, "Oh, it's just out of your reach, huh?" So my son is currently losing his mind. I need to. Uh, he loses a lot of his toys, like underneath the couch and underneath the entertainment stand. So what I need to do is I need to. Uh, I've been wanting to put some like wood on the bottom of the couch, so he'll stop losing his toys as frequently. I hear you out there, Bubba. What's up? Oh, you're in here now. You, you made it. He has breached containment. Yeah. <laughs> He's gone, dude. He doesn't care. <laughs> He's a little menace, dude. Um, give me one sec, man. I'm going to turn this light on here. It's a, little, it's a little dim today, you know what I mean? Reach over here. Light me up a little bit better. It's a little overcast. I got my window full open, but also I should open up my my beverage. Drink this tall boy natty ice. No, it's another Arizona energy tea. You know, typically when I'm not feeling good, I like to crack open a tall boy. <laughs> I'm sick and out of my bloody mind. Um, Alright, so we're still still hunting bugs, I guess. Bugs and fish. Um, we got everything there. If I could hit the right buttons. We got everything in the pond. Uh, the estuary is cleared up. 
Then we got everything at the lighthouse. I think we've fished all the fish we can fish for fall. I think we're we're in a really well, at least for windy day. Uh, I think we need a rainy day because I feel like that's gonna be uh, our next optimal day to go fish hunting. But yeah, we've got everything right now. We've we've caught, and then we're just still struggling with the last couple of insects right now. That's super gross. I'm sorry about that. Actually, I'm not sorry. I'm sick. Uh, so it looks like the Black Widow is the only thing I can try to get my hands on today. Which we will, uh, when nightfall hits, we're going to make a pretty good hunt for it. Um, oh, and the Atlas Moth. Yet again, I think, I don't know if I can even catch them with the Silver, silver Net. Because, um, like, I got really kind of hosed out of that. Let's go talk to Sunny and see what it'll cost to make the gold net. That'll kind of hem me up for a couple of days, but I think we'll be okay. What is my catching level at? Oh, we're at a catching seven. We're at a pretty good, uh, pretty good level with that. Part of me was almost wondering, because like when I was trying to catch those widows uh, in the last stream, I had two of them within the range of my net, and I couldn't, like, it didn't catch them. So I'm wondering if, which seems weird, you should be able to catch things regardless of uh, if, you can, if you can actually close the gap, you should be fine. Oh, they're closed. Are they closed? Oh, they're closed today. Okay, never mind. I mean, I already have a feeling I know what is required to get the uh, gold gold bug net, which I think I should really do if I'm going to try catching some of these bugs. Cause I... So probably on the next day we'll gather up all the materials and uh, we'll get the gold net. It'll head me up for a couple of days, but I've got 12 days left to fall. So i got plenty of time to try and catch the last bugs I need. But if I really need um, the damned gold net to even catch them, I, I need to I need to do that. <laughs> My son is having a good time. Uh, all right, we'll go check on the hardwood, and then uh, yeah, we'll uh, I'm gonna order a ton of grass. Planks. Get him on that. Grass squares. We go crazy. We go crazy today. Ah, I started too far back. Yep, and the, the other further goal, um, I mean, we're we're closing in on it. We're going to uh, hurt ourselves a little bit getting the, the gold uh, bug net, but it'll be okay. Is, uh... Oh, wait, what the hell? When did that... When did that get there? Huh? Cause that that must be the the dig site up there, huh? Did I just never notice that. It's possible I never noticed that. Huh? Huh? Crazy. Um. It's a shame those don't uh, catch rare bugs. I need to make something for the flying bugs, too. Oh, the door's full. That is fair. Ah, oh, 174. We might... We might be able... To, uh... To, uh... Do the, um... Thing. 
you know, that thing. Uh, get the house upgrade today. That would be pretty cool. Okay. We're doing good, we're doing good. Alright, let's order some grass. Let's do, you know, we'll do a solid, uh, we'll start with a, start with a hundo. I'm going to plumb a smooth. We are, uh, my goal here is to, um, fill out this whole quadrant today. Oh, I was up here. Okay. So it's... One big solid chunk of the farm done would look really sweet. Just curious. My brain. My brain works in often stupid and mysterious ways. That's why you guys are here, right? It's because I'm special. Ed, mostly. Um. My therapist thinks I'm special. Come on, sturgeons, keep getting it on. Uh, it is night time. Eat that. And we are going to go out bug hunting. I seem to find a lot of the widows uh, sort of down this way. You're a cool little guy. Come here. Go for the Larry. Little spiky boy. Probably gonna head north up into the forest next, honestly. Um, to see if I can't also catch an Atlas moth. Which I believe I still need one of those guys too. I need a lot of stuff. Now the problem with bug hunting up in the forest area is it's um, often harder to see. Because of the grass. There's an Alice moth literally right to my right. Come on. Come on. Yoink. Easy catch. Easy dub. Oh, I was supposed to check on Lucas, wasn't I? Um, keep my finger away from the dash button. Just in case. Oh, I caught one of the ones I was looking for. That's pretty good. honest I don't particularly care about checking on Lucas not to be not to be a jerk but uh just don't we gonna hide another bug in the clipped into the rock Are we gonna do that again or that would be particularly cool of you guys to do some stupid stuff like that again I was absolutely getting dunked on last stream, dude. Couldn't catch any of the bugs I was trying to catch. Harvest Festival. I got cheated. Game cheats. 
Hello, my son. How are you? You scream. We all scream for ice cream. You are well taken care of. I was giving him treats like crazy this morning, too. Despite the fact that my son decided he didn't want to cuddle with me last night. I'm not hurt about it or anything. You're crying about Fitzy. You got everything in the world. Really, I mean the cat. He's he's got everything he'd ever want and need. Come here. It's very full. All right, I guess we'll head back. I didn't see any widows today. For some reason, spawns for bugs in this game feel kind of weird. But I mean, they are rare. You know, I'm, I'm like looking for all like the super rare stuff, so it's kind of not surprising when I don't find stuff. Oh my god, my box is full. I have I have filled up the box. What? There's 118 items in the box. Alright, Grasshopper, you're coming to bed with me. I have filled that's the first time I've ever put enough individual items in the box to fill it. This should be a pretty uh, righteous payday. 14k? Not bad. I sold my effing Atlas Moth. Oh no! You stupid son of a bitch! You needed that, you dumbass! Oh no! God dang it! God dang it! Oh, the bok choy is uh, always worth good money, though. That sucks. Oh, uh, pickle bok choy sells for four hundred. 54 osmium level. It's very nice. Oh. Uh, uh, <laughs> I hurt my feelings, bro. Don't work so hard today, okay? I don't want you to get sick. Honey, I'm a step ahead of you. Ain't no rest for the wicked. I can't believe I sold the Atlas Moth, dude. I was not paying attention. No, that stinks. That's I'm such a silly sausage. Oh, just have to go catch another one. I say that like it's very easy to find. I found that one relatively easy. Hey look, my cranberries that now grow at uneven times. It drives me insane now. Another harvest of fairy roses. More tarot roots. Um, Alright, we are open for business on another plot here. Tarot root really ain't worth anything, really. Um, alright, we need... Well, first of all, let's refill all of this. We'll do another thing of pickled bok choy. Um, some more grapes. Let's take a rose honey. Get rid of, finish up all these gardenias. Um, sake here. Maybe I'll do. Oops, that's right there. It's a sunny day today, so that's good. Maybe I'll do another thing of rice, I think. Rice is only nine days. Yeah, we'll do, we'll do another harvest of rice. I got plenty of I got time for it, so. Yeah, Eleven days. We might, we might be able to make it to winter the stream. Or we're gonna get like, right on the cusp of it. Depending on how 
early. I want to end days. Considering we're still, like, on the hunt for, uh, most of the bugs. Um, we will probably be running most days pretty late. If you see me mouth breathing, please, I'm, my nose is congested and I don't always, it's not always clear and I'm trying not to, like, do, like, snot snorts. Like that. It's fun. I love you guys. I also just really wanted to stream today. Regardless if I'm sick or not, you know how it is. I, uh, I'm gonna be here. I'm gonna be streaming. I love doing it. I love streaming. If I could do this every single day, I would. I absolutely would. Like, you guys would not get rid of me if I could. Playing in something big for 100 subscribers. We're closing in pretty close, actually. We're at 97 right now. So if you haven't, make sure you like, subscribe, get us to 100. We're gonna do something, uh, do something big. What that big thing is, uh, I have not decided. Um, we'll probably just do an extra long. And when I mean extra long, we're talking like 8 to 10 hour stream. We're going to do like a super long stream. Um, probably play something. I don't know yet. And uh, we'll have just a super cool, like, super stream. It could be, we could split it up and play two different things. Or I might try to play, like, one game and beat it in, like, one sitting. You know what I mean? Like, I might try to do that. I figured that'd be kind of cool. I haven't figured it out yet. I don't know what game I'd play. Um, or what. Um, Alright, let's check fish forecast first. Sunny day. I don't know if there's much of a difference for fish when it comes to sun or not. I don't think so. I think that's it matters the most for the, the bugs. Okay, all right. So we've we've caught all the fish we need. This is the problem I'm having. Um, all right, the wrong button again. I keep hitting B. All right, so we can we can basically find everything we need to find. Um. Today. Town has the most, and it bothers me, but. But once you see them once, then they run off. Like they're not you're not gonna see another one. So if you mess up, that's that's it. So Um, let's go I'm gonna go talk to Sunny today too. Let's go figure out Um the cost of a gold fishnet. Or bug net, sorry. Fishnet. But also catch bugs on my way. We gotta be pretty close to level. Oh, we are. Yeah, we're pretty close. Um, better quality, price increase. Since last longer would probably be good. As I commence the long and arduous process of trying to catch all the bugs in the fish. Look at all the crabs! Look, Dad, they're playing! No, nah, no, nah, we don't wanna be too noisy. We might scare them off. We don't wanna do that. No, ma'am. We don't want to do that. Well, that was nice. Guess what? The Coral Reefs are in the playoffs, baby. Yeah, feels so good. <laughs> the 
volleyball playoffs. Maybe I didn't tell you? We have a chance to qualify for the tournament in Pokyo. Playing the Pokyo Volleyball Tournament has been my dream ever since I was a kid, and now I'm just one game away. Coral Reefs never qualified before, but they never had me on their team before either. Okay, I'll admit it. I'm a little nervous. But I know we have a good shot. After all, I'm the best volleyball player you know, right Lee? I'm sure you'll make it. You're the good luck charm. Ah, oh, thanks. When it takes practice. Practice, practice. Speaking of which, I'm going to hit the ball around now. You want to help me out until the team gets here? Just spikes it into my head. Just takes me right out. Let's do this. She was she was high in my on my list of uh, the romances. Possibly because I, I like muscle mommies. Gah, I hope none of those, none of them saw me take a spill. I have a reputation to protect. And I know she's kind of the rough and tumble type, but uh, I'm sure she's a lot sweeter than... Anyway, I better get back out there. I bet she's got a lot sweeter, uh, a much sweeter side. Hey, Lee. You can hang out and watch us if you want. Okay, Coral Reefs, let's show them what we can do. I'm sorry, but if a bunch of ladies uh, offered to let me hang out during their volleyball practice, I wouldn't say no. Wouldn't say no. Also, uh, technically, my guy was already on the beach hanging out. Shop's got new items. Flying insect scent. I was wearing a flying insect came to use attached to a trap. Just sells sardines. Upgrade. All right. Technically, already have the gold fishing pole. Five. Oh, it's only five. Uh, gold kelp essence and five hardwood. Um, okay. So I do lose five hardwood, which sets me back like a day, technically. Because you get about four to five hardwood per um, log. It sets me back a little bit, but I need the I need the gold bug net, I think. Do I even have the five gold cup essence I do? Let's, uh, I'm going to make the sacrifice here. Um, as I said, it's going to hold me up a little bit. But, uh, I think it's, I think it's for a good cause. Um, because I don't, I don't think I can catch any of those rare bugs without the gold net. I think I need the higher tier net to even pull it off. Because I was, I was struggling. I was struggling. And, uh, the last thing I want to do is come into contact and be in the perfect situation, like, catch them in my, and, like, try to catch them, and then the game just says, uh, no. Like, you, you can't. Like, you literally can't. So, two days, uh, I'll be back. I'll be back to catching bugs. So, it's unfortunate that I am now without the capacity to catch bugs. Um, oh, let's head up to the lab. Um, because after I get the gold, I mean, I need the gold watering can, but I don't necessarily need the gold watering can, you know what I mean? I mean, we'll upgrade to the gold watering can, because we can. There's no reason not to. Oh, anybody got a errand I can actually? He wants a beat! Alright, I can do that, actually. I already have one on me. Urgent request. Mark needs a beat. Um, I'll find Mark in just a second. The lab real fast. Um, great produce quality. Uh, we can do the silver saplings. I haven't done that. Uh, this stuff's gold, which I'm happy with for now. Uh, we haven't even started getting the osmium kelp essence yet. We'll do that in winter. 
Uh, but I want to upgrade all this stuff. So, I need seven silver kelp. I don't even think I have that anymore. Um, to be, to be honest, I think I'm, I think I'm, I'm low on silver. We gotta head, head down and go get some silver. Uh, no, I don't have a lot. Um, let me, yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to go get some more silver. Disappointing. Well, I know what we're doing the rest of the day. We're gonna go get some silver kelp. Um, Sag. But, it could be that way. So let's go get some silver kelp real quick. So that's for the trees. Which, I mean, they're only at bronze, but I mean, it's kind of a waste at this point. Shit, that sucks. Um, I'm all the way up here, and I need to be uh, all the way down there. Should use the fast travel point. Um, okay. Uh, right there. Go back and go get some of that, that other gold that was back there. I don't see any reason not to grab it from right next to it. Just oh my God. catch net. I can't catch any of these fun little sea critters. The uh, freaking frame rate down here seems to be struggling. Also, too, if I'm gonna keep passing glances over at my OBS. Um, for those of you who uh, don't watch any of the other streams, we've been struggling. Our internet here has been acting super weird. I don't know if it's the internet or if it's OBS or what's going on. Um, but our stuff's been acting mad weird. We were having like really bad like disconnects and stuff like that. And uh, today I'm kind of running, running the gambit. Uh, I found hard wiring in to my router um, was helping to alleviate that issue but I'm not hardwired in right now I want to see if that issue is still persisting so if the stream tanks um, or starts tanking please just alert me um, I might not notice it immediately um, and then I will just we'll just pause real quick and I'll hardline back in uh, it's, it'll only take me a couple minutes I stream on Wi-Fi like an animal, but we also have our equipment. And by our, I mean all the the really, really, really expensive cable modem and my Wi-Fi router are um, are very strong. Although my modem is uh, on the on the older side, it might be time to replace it. So I'm looking at replacements right now. My problem is, is I like really high-end stuff, and I like stuff that's so good I can future-proof myself. My modem is very old at this point, uh, in terms of tech years, um, and is in pretty, I mean, it's still in perfectly good shape. I could, I could give it to someone who probably needs, uh, less power than I do, and, uh, they'd probably still be happy with it. But I noticed our speed slowed down a little bit, and I don't know if that's because of my end, or if it's because of, you know, my provider, but... 
We'll see. All right, we'll head back around, see if we can find some more silver kelp. But, uh, yeah. I, uh... been contemplating calling my internet provider and uh, seeing what they can do for me in terms of speeds. If, I can, if we can upgrade my speed anymore without, like, causing, costing me an arm and a leg. Because that's the last thing I want to do is have to pay, you know, $300 a month for just slightly faster internet. So if we can get it upgraded for, you know, a few extra bucks, that'd be cool because then that would improve the quality of everything. We already have pretty fast internet, um, as is. Our internet is decidedly much faster than a normal person's. But we stream and we do all sorts of other stuff, so it makes sense that our, uh, you know, my buddy lives with me, so we, we want, I want fast internet. I want, I want to be able to download stuff fast. I don't, uh, I don't want to have to go to install a game and then it takes six hours to, okay, so that's bronze kelp. I mean, we pretty much, we've been pretty much everywhere. Um, I'm just going to head on back. Get all this uh, silver kelp processed. A full inventory right now, so put that in there. Just tuck that away in there for now. Uh, let's go to the dehydrator. I got two of them now. I don't really need. Hydrators, but you know, be like that. Taro root juice. Oh, I got wine. Oh, yeah, bro. Sorry, I got a little bit gold too. Where is ya? Where is ya hiding? Oh, I relish these moments where one of my nostrils is actually clear enough I can breathe. Oh, unobstructed breathing. How come whenever it is you're sick? And your nose is all congested. You really like you just completely forget what it's like to breathe normally. I'm just like, bro. I just want to be able to live my life in peace. And your body's like, nah, bro. You know, peace only problems. Sixteen k, too bad. Taro juice, 120, sake, super good. Um, yeah, fairy roses, dude, insane. Fairy roses are super good. So, that blueberry wine, 598. Windy day again. Are you gonna give me a kiss? Yes. So quiet here in the morning. Well, quiet compared to the end here. I hear all sorts of animals. It's really nice. Sweetie, would you like a flower? Can I give you a flower? Looks yummy. Th oh, uh, not, not quite the answer I expected. Mom just looks happy today. She just takes the flower out of my hand and just eats it. <laughs> just, just hogs that boy down. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, boy. What is that? I don't know what that is. It looks delicious, though. Fried rice! You know what? I'm going to eat it right now. Fried rice at 6 a.m.? Was I drinking the night before? Is that... 
Uh, do some eggplants. Try to get rid of all these tomatoes, honestly. That's all that. Aside of, like, the sea creature stuff, I haven't found any other use for the dehydrator. It doesn't seem to do much other than, like, <laughs> creatures from the deeps. Flash my amaranth going in. Hey, oh, garlic's already. Let's uh, make some space. Ready to drives me nuts. We got some fruits here. Hey, oh, I got some of that stuff. Uh, Smilver. I think I can actually take that up to the. This is all still water too, which is cool. I can do that. Uh, let's let the animals out before I get too distracted and forget to let them out, and then I feel bad. I want to let them stretch their legs before winter hits, and I can't let them out. You know? I don't. Ah! I think that's the command I wanted. Alright, my inventory is like full, so I have to. Yeah, offer, and I can offer that. Let's go do that real quick before I just offload all of my gummits. Boink. Cranberries really ain't worth much. I don't know if I'll uh, focus on doing cranberries again. They're, they're nice as like a constant crop. But, uh... Oh, cool, I got two more of those. And I think I've got an almond tree planted. I might be able to... Uh, get this fruit plant done, which will give me access to the warp season. Which would be pretty cool. Be pretty cool. I'm really curious to see what that does. Cool. Now I'm just gonna because I can't really do I can't like pickle garlic. I can't do anything with garlic last I checked. Um I can't throw it in the dehydrator. I can't throw it in the oil press. I can't mill it. Um, I might just sell it, honestly. Garlic's worth, uh, a good chunk of change. You know what? Like, my, my feelings are not being hurt if I can't process it. If it's worth just a good chunk of cash, then, like, so be it. Like, that's worth a good chunk of cash. Um, let's see, I got ten days left. We need another, another go here. Yeah, it's nine days. Could do another thing of garlic. That'd be pretty cool. Um, I could do barley. I could do another barley harvest. The barley beer is worth a lot of money, but I already got rice growing to make sake, so I don't really want to have that overlap. Um, jackfruit, cocoa seedling. Let's, uh, yeah, we'll do another thing of garlic. Why not? And if I already planted garlic, then we got another thing. Of, gosh dang it. Bloody unintuitive menu. Bloody me being stupid enough to do the thing. For those of you uh, who are kind of newer to the channel and don't know um, all of my insane proclivities, um, so I have a propensity to play, uh, like I like FPS games, 
like a lot, like first person shooters. And I play a lot of them, like, especially if they have campaigns, I like to play them on the highest difficulty. And, uh, there's, you know, the Call of Duty games have always been really good for it because they're usually absurdly difficult. Um, and so I've been kind of, like, ever since the whole, like, acquisition, like, Microsoft bought Activision and stuff like that, I've been kind of impatiently waiting for him to drop the entire Call of Duty catalog so I can go through and play all the other games that I've never had the chance to play because they're still outlandishly expensive. Like, outlandishly. Like, I'm not paying $30 for a game that came out seven years ago. Like, I'm sorry, you're not... I don't know what... what realm we're in right now that uh, GameStop thinks that, you know, some of these games are worth that price, but... Like, you guys, you guys are out of your... You're, uh... Off your rocker, as it were. Uh, let's grab those. And then... Uh, yeah, we'll head over to the lab real quick. I'm gonna upgrade my trees. But yeah, there's a, there's a few of them I haven't played yet on their uh, veteran campaigns. It's just it's hard to want to spend that much money just to play. Um... You know, a campaign I'm only going to play for uh, a hot minute. If they have a zombies mode, then it's kind of cool, because I feel like I've spent, uh, you know, I got more out of it. I'll get more out of it then. But then I'm also only just playing by myself. So it's like, well, do I buy a second copy for my buddy so we can play some zombies together, or like, what? One thing I love about my friends is one of the things we do is we, we buy each other games all the time. Like, it's, um, you know, life is hard. And if I've got some extra schmeckles and it's not going to hurt me financially, um, I will buy you a game. And we will, uh, we will make sure we play together. Because that's one of the things. I mean, if you're excited to play something, you know what I mean? Like, it sucks when your buddy might not be in a spot to buy it and you really want to play with them. Uh, we did that for the, my buddy bought a copy of the Outlast Trials for my other friend. And, uh, oh, I did not come over here and check on you guys. Uh, one of the unfortunate parts, though, is uh, we're having troubles with the Outlast Trials, which is an awesome game, by the way. Super fun. But we're having connectivity issues, so. Really kind of takes the piss out of it. And the weird part is it's me and my buddy that live together. We're on the same internet. And for some reason the game is like, nah, you, you two can't connect together. You guys can't play. I'm like, bruh. We're on the same internet. <laughs> what is it? What do you mean? Alright, let's, let's get some more grass in here. So I require more. We'll we get another. Yeah, we'll get another Amaranth or two. I don't remember what the time rating is on Amaranth, but... That'd be cool. Also, I don't know if any of y'all are anime fans, but uh, the next season's about to kick up, and there is so many good animes getting ready to air. I'm so excited. The time I got reincarnated as the Slimes next season's coming up. Big fan of that. One of the few isekais that I really like. Um, I used to... There's only there's only a couple of isekais that I, I really, really like. And most of the other ones, I just kind of tolerate them. But, uh... Yeah, super excited for that. There's, there's, oh my gosh, there's a Kaiju number eight's coming out. That looks sick. So many good shows are just like wrapping up right now, though, and it's like I feel sad because I'm like, well, I had 24 episodes to watch this, and now it's like, it's like, yeah, we're gonna go on break now, and I'm like, uh, please, no, I don't want that. Anymore. Free run coming to a uh, 
a close for the season was really a, a blow to my my health. Hey, we're getting there. We are uh, getting bloody somewhere. Still more rose honey. I worked to get rid of all these damn gardenias. Uh, let's do another pickled eggplant. Let me get rid of all these tomatoes. I'm also just trying to build up as large of a stockpile of various goods and services. Um, why'd I do it that way? I don't know. For uh, winter, because I'm not really going to have much else to do. During the winter months, so we're gonna be, be kind of quiet. Um, I might have access to some of the winter seeds, which is pretty cool. Um, so hopefully we can we can actually grow a couple of things during the winter. Because I have some snowdrop seeds, I don't know how many if I can purchase any more though. That's kind of my big thing. It's like if I can purchase more. If we can get the house upgrade going, dude, I'm so freaking excited. Let's go check my bug traps. Hey, there's a ton of stuff up here. Yoink. Yoink. But no, seriously, if uh, none of y'all are watching, like, Shangri-La Frontier or anything like that, I need, I need, I need at least one of y'all to start watching that, because it's so good. It's so good. Be able to hit that 200 hardwood today, guys. That's all I'm saying. We might be able to get that today. Um, we really can't do any bug hunting. Um, I have no reason to really go diving right now. So we're sort of, sort of bing chilling right now. As I said, I want to continue the bug hunt, but uh, we can't currently. I'll be able to go and pick up my net though here soon. In a day or two. These days feel kind of long, so I get kind of kind of messed up and I forget. We'll uh, we'll mosey on over uh, to the other side. We're just gonna go kill some time. Uh, try to find any more forageables and stuff like that. Uh, to my Bug nets. Bug nests. Uh, we do also have this uh, Halloween uh, event, which I believe they updated, so everybody's supposed to have their own Halloween costumes now. I believe that was part of one of the last updates. Ups, 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 ups. Updates? If I can get my words to come out of my mouth correctly. So fun. So fun being congested. Not really. It's one of my least favorite things in the whole world, actually. I rather enjoy unobstructed breathing. Except I have a deviated septum. So if I lay on my right side while I'm sleeping at night, I literally cannot breathe out of my nose. It's, uh, it's great. I lay on my left side, dude. I get the best night's sleep. I lay on my right side, bro. I'm waking up, dude. I'm mouth agape like a fish. I am just probably hewing timber all night. I'm snoring. I'm 
like it's bad. It's bad. Just gonna call it. I mean, there's really no reason not to. Decent little day. Garlic with the bit there. Nice, 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 nice. Cool. You smell nice. How's your day? You look a bit tired. Let's rest soon, okay? My god, I just really want somebody to say that to me in real life. And tell me that I smell nice too. I actually take pride in that. Um, I always try to smell nice because the last thing um, I want is people to be like, yo, you kinda, you kinda stink. That would legitimately like hurt my feelings. Oddly enough, I can identify why I desire to smell good at all times, too. Yep, there's that full inventory. We'll keep all the loads here. We'll keep all the amaranth. Uh, all the flour. Eggplants are good too. Eggplants are a great crop, honestly. Uh, wow. No, uh. Oops. Hitting X. No bronze here, Amber, aren't they? I mean, I'll take it. All silver gold. I got one reg, but. That's fine by me, honestly. We haven't gotten to my Osmium tier sake, which I'm pretty sure is going to be worth an absolute shitload. Okay. Let's uh, water all these guys. We might have to uh, exit back to main menu. I think my game might be starting to do that thing where it gets a little kooky. So on the next day, um, we will we'll have to reload. Uh, simply because you can you can see uh, I can't see the pattern anymore from my watering, which is a clear sign that the game is starting to act fruity. Um, I can also tell those batteries are technically done. So the next like thing of batteries should be. Produced, but I I just think that the game's uh, goofing up. I was I was reading reviews for this game on the Xbox uh, Marketplace, and apparently crashing is real bad for some people. Um, which of course I find interesting because um, aside of when the game originally came out, uh, in like the first like month or so of it being, or first couple months of it being out. Um, there hasn't been a single issue uh, for me, at least. I've been I've been pretty blessed with uh, the game running very well, very well for me. I saw some visual glitches and occasional uh, minor stuff. It's all been extremely minor. Um, the issues we've been having, nothing a, a quick reload uh, of the game can't handle. So it's pretty pretty damn good. Kind of, kind of waiting for the next uh, update to roll through and add uh, more stuff. Imagine it'll probably be soonish, I'd imagine, but I don't know. I'm not super familiar with the devs uh, and kind of what their their workflow cycle looks like, so I don't want to necessarily put any sort of you know kind of anything on it. 
I'm just simply excited. There is dragon fruit somewhere. There it is. Just to sell that. Not worth the hassle. All right. So I will be right back. I am going to go use the little boy's room. Okay, I'm back. Hey. Let's refill all these receptacles. We'll do some. Oh, I can't put pumpkins in there, eh? Let's pick beets. What can I do with the pumpkins? I don't remember what I can. I think I can make like pumpkin juice or some shit. Yes, I did just kind of, I didn't pause the game while I got up to use the restroom. I let the time go because we're, everything kind of runs itself right now. Um, yeah, again, as I said, I wanted to save the diving for winter when we need something to actually do. Because we're going to be kind of caught up with nothing to do during winter. Um, so, you know. Trying to, uh, trying to keep positive. We are, though, um, getting, getting rather close to what I would consider sort of a, uh, an end point in our Coral Island journey, um, as we discussed in the last Coral Island stream. Um, Stardew Valley is looking like it might be our next one. There's a couple of other games, too, um. There's, like, my time at Porsche and stuff like that. And my time at Sand Rock and some, uh, like, Harvest Moon adjacent games. I also think there's a... Was it Rune Factory 4? My friend Kyle has played that. And he seemed to really enjoy his time with that. So that might also be... Um, uh, a possibility on our list. Um, I want to sort of wait for Stardew because there's the big 1.6 update and I really don't want to jump back into it until that happens because I'd hate to be in the middle of playing and then have that come out and kind of throw a wrench in our plans. Um, on Xbox anyways, the 1.6 update is out on PC, it is not out for Xbox yet, so um, I'm hoping by the time we're all wrapped up with this that... Uh, Sort of uh, ready. That being said, I think Coral Island is going to be going down to just Sundays again because we are sort of 
rapidly approaching our um kind of end point and i don't want to uh rush to the end of I, I am trying to parse the game out as much as possible so that way we can get uh closer to whatever the next major update is to add more stuff so we can keep uh we can keep playing uninterrupted and i don't have to you know come back back go back and forth uh essentially So close. Um, I think tomorrow, the next day, we'll be able to go pick up uh, our bug net so we can continue our bug hunt. Uh, we'll just go look for scavenge bowls and coconuts and stuff. Pad our earnings with a little bit more. Uh... Hello, wife. How are you? Just hanging out here reading? Nice. Um, but yeah, we're gonna... I don't want Coral Island to end. You know what I mean? And, I mean, we could always start another playthrough, but I kind of don't want to start a new, new playthrough again. Um, just realistically, the only difference I'd have in my playthrough is, aside of, aside of knowing what to do now... Um, it would just be essentially romancing, uh, somebody new. That's really the only difference you'd have, uh, in a new playthrough. Or just going, you know, absolutely mental, uh, right out the gates and trying to, you know, maximize farm efficiency and stuff like that. But I don't, uh, I don't want to play like that, so... So I'm thinking uh, after this, we'll, we'll 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 play something else. We'll probably, as I said, I want to. We'll try to get to get up to and through year three. Um, we'll see how that goes. Because if I'm playing and I I feel like I'm getting like super bored, and it's just basically waiting for days to end. Um, because, like, we're, we're at pretty much the end of the whole, like, ocean cleanup thing. And, uh, really a side of, um, there's a bug on my farm. That's weird. Bugs never show up on the farm. Um, and a side of, like, that and a couple of, like, random things. There's not a lot of content left to do. Ah, oh, shit. I was supposed to take that, uh... Huh. Sorry about that, uh, Mark. Uh, yeah. Forgot to take you the beat. Don't really care if you like me or not. Yeah, we're just gonna go to bed. Uh, we're just gonna end the day. I don't really... There's really no other ranching level up. Cool. Max stamina went up. Very nice. I haven't gotten... Do I have any of my osmium level sake yet? No, I don't think so. It's just a decent little day. We're up over 200,000, though. We are balling out. After all this time, saying this is our home still gives me butterflies. It feels good to have something to share with you. Something that belongs to just the two of us. Don't worry, honey. It's going to belong to a whole family here soon. I'm going to get this house upgraded. And we'll have little minions running around. And I'm super curious as to how the children are going to look. <laughs> That's been uh, something heavy on my mind uh, since since I realized that there's you are, you have the capacity to have children in this game. Is, uh, what are the children going to look like? Those aren't ready. Those aren't ready. I got, like, a couple of cranberries ready. I don't remember what you are. No, there's a osmium sake. Can't wait 
wait and see what that sake is going to be worth. Uh, a very nice penny. Ah, shit. I wanted to... No, it seems to be working fine now. We got about uh, two more in-game days before we can uh, get the upgraded house. Yeah, see, these batteries aren't ticking over. Um, I don't necessarily need them at the moment, so I don't really care. Um, but uh, it, is, it is frustrating that that's a big, a big bug that happens every time we play. So, ooh, gold large. I will say, too, something that uh, kind of irritates me about the game is the whole leveling up the town thing just feels, like, almost too difficult. Like, so much of it, like, the whole, um, uh, like, it'd be cool if it wasn't so tied to basically healing the coral. Because, like, I feel like that's the big, big part of it that, you know... Because each museum piece only gives you three, and it looks like healing the coral sites does all the work for you. Um, it seems like it's all pretty much tied to that. It'd be nice if the stuff from the museum gave you, um, you know, a little bit more. And some of the stuff in the museum is really hard to get. Like, some of the, like, the gems and stuff like that, like, the, the kind of the odd stuff is not easy to get your hands on. Like, I don't know how much mining you would actually, how many hours of mining you'd have to do. Because they try to find geodes, like the gem clusters, is super hard. Those do not show up frequently. All right, we should be able to go retrieve our uh, bug net. And it's a mini day again, which means uh, the... <laughs> The creature, the creepy crawlies we're looking for are not going to be active today. But it's okay. We will, uh... We will persevere. Sonny! I need my bug net. Thanks, bud. Sonny, you a real one, man. I know I paid you for a service, but you a real one. Damn. Nice. Range on that thing's better. If only I can move a tiny bit faster, that'd be pretty cool too, but you know, I'll take what I can get. A little bit of an extended range is nice. It looks like a wider catch radius. I don't know if it's any longer. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know if it's... Um, any more length out from your character, which would be really insanely good. But, uh, you know. I I can get rid of all of my tomato jam right now, which makes me really happy. Get rid of all them damn silver tomatoes. Taking up space in my damn inventory. Stream seems to be holding up pretty good. Let me uh check something here. Stream health has been really good. Fantastic. I'm super happy about that. Cool. Cool. 
us. I know, it's like I'm, I'm like nervous casting furtive glances at OBS. OBS was also disconnected a lot the other day. Uh, Friday. Disconnected twice. We're streaming Resident Evil 5. I don't appreciate that shit. Not that I pay for OBS, but, you know. Do, do your job, damn it. You're supposed to connect me, not disconnect me. Oh, we're so close. So freaking close. Um, let's... We're gonna mosey on over to the carpenter. I wanna double check all of the requirements again for the next house upgrade. As long as they're open today. If not, then it's okay. We'll just kinda walk over there. I could go and try to chop down a bunch of regular trees and see if I can get some hardwood, but there's only a 2% chance of getting, uh, hardwood from a normal tree. So it's really... Really not worth making me. You guys are cold today, aren't you? God, every single time, dude, I want to go check something out. <laughs> Everybody's always closed. My timing is what some would call atrocious. So we also need to get the horse, too. For no other reason than to just get the horse. Seven more. Seven more hardwood. I know we need, uh, two hundo. I know that's that number's been stuck in my head ever since. And I know there's an area you can unlock. Well, my buddy told me about it. That, uh, gives you access to trees that'll drop hardwood reliably. But I don't have access to that. So, yet again, all right, let's just take a look at this. Winter season. Snowdrop. I got seeds for that. That was super easy. I need an Osmium Snowdrop, which shouldn't be too hard for... I think that's rare crops. Yeah, I need an Osmium Snowdrop. Uh, that should be pretty easy to obtain here. Um, precious gems. We've had basically no luck with any of this. Um, rare ranching products. Two animals I don't have access to. And then rare cooking, uh, I haven't uh, haven't really tried. So and that unlocks the savanna access. Um, we're about to get the uh, warp, uh, the warp, uh, the dig site. We're we're a way off from. I don't have access to any of these fish currently. The pink snapper, the sheephead, or the yellowfin. Uh, rare fish. We do have to at least two of those. And then, as I said, the freaking arapaima, or no, it's the arowana. Sorry is uh, winter, so I'll be able to catch that one. And then tiger beetle, I think, is spring. And then night insects are here, but I can't. I've been struggling. As I said, so we're super close. We almost have the greenhouse unlocked. We'll have that unlocked in winter, which I feel like is going to be fun. Um, which makes me think I should buy some... Uh, fall seeds for the greenhouse and plant some stuff so that way I can make more money we actually did really good through winter uh, last time and that's mostly because like there's nothing to like really buy or do so like we were able to kind of go crazy dude we, we went kind of nuts last winter with just animal products and uh making artisan goods out of scavengeables. We made a lot of money. Uh, it was it was pretty sweet. We ended up leaving winter with more money, and I didn't think we were really going to be able to pull that off. And then we, we did, and I was like, oh. Is Taco? Taco back? That's normally where Taco likes to hang out, is right in that spot. Taco! Taco! Come here, boy. No luck so far. It's the longest time he has left the house. I think he really did go home. Don't give up yet. I'm sure Taco lost track of time. Playing too much. Maybe he found a new friend. He'll be home soon. Yeah, I think that makes sense. I shall not give up. Thank you. 
checking the beach might be a good idea. Oh, am I on like a little quest? I get to go. Ah, we're gonna find Taco. We'll find a pupper. Yes. As someone who has lost a pet, they got out, and uh, you know we never, never found them again. It's uh, it's extremely heartbreaking. There's Taco, you cute little bugger. Come here, play with a crab. <laughs> He's so cute, dude. Lucas is worried sick about you. There you are, boy. Lucas is worried sick about you. <laughs> Oh, Taco, there you are, my boy. Taco, where have you been? I thought you went back to the mountain. Sniff. Oh, look how cute that bumper is. Come on. Lee, thank you for your help. I think I know why he came here to play. He lived over at the inn for a while. Maybe he just missed his ocean friends. All good now. I should take him back, give him a proper bath. Come over to the vineyard sometime, will you? Let's hang out. You're a cool dude. Let's go home, boy. It's Luke, not Lucas Lee. Maybe he wants to be called Lucas. I don't know. But we found his dog. And that makes me happy. We have found a pooch in the pooch's home. Hey, this looks like free money. This is free money hanging from these trees. Oh, this is a cool looking caterpillar. Can I get you? Oh, it's just a monarch. I've caught that before. Couldn't remember what it was. Give me those cocoa nuts. I will go nuts for cocoa nuts. Can't come out at night and look for that widow again. Uh, and hopefully catch one. Yet again, we are we're we're a while off. I mean we're 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 fighting the tide here at C rank to uh get to B rank. We're we are a literal mile off. It's, uh, it's almost depressing how long it's going to take. But, uh, we shall persevere. I really have to sneeze. Oh my gosh. Come on. A very moist. Oh, I really cleared my nose up, though. Uh. <laughs> That's a gold white truffle. It should be worth a lot of money. That felt so good, guys. That felt so good. <laughs> right, I think I got another one. Oh, my gosh. Ugh. <coughs> uh. Hey guys, being sick is great. Uh, oh, that feels so good though. I like how I'm sick and the first thing I'm like, hey yo, we got a stream on Sunday. <laughs> a normal human being can be like, oh, I'm gonna rest instead of streaming for three hours. And I'm like, hey, who said I'm a normal human being? Whoever told you that's a liar. I'm actually three possums in a trench coat, but you know, we don't talk about that all, all that often. Animal control will come looking for me. Odd how I caught there were so many widows over here. I kept seeing them over and over again, but now there's like none. I'm gonna wait until 8 o'clock. Uh, let's head back up to the forest real quick and try to catch us a uh, another Atlas moss, and hopefully I don't sell it again like a total doofus. We will, uh, in the morning, we will reset the day, though. We'll, we'll reload at the menu. From 
goodness. Plum tired of the game, uh, goofing up on me. You know what I mean? Yeah. <sighs> Oh, Titan Arm. Even a silver Titan Arm is worth a lot. I think I just, I think I just need to sell. Oh, here we go. Oh, that's bogus! You were in my catch range, bro! You lit up and I like... Oh, this game is testing my freaking patience sometimes, man. I remember that flying bugs need a different scent than ground bugs, and I still think that's kind of bogus, but you know. Hell yeah. Because this is all open. The game did not a super great job alerting me to certain things being open, to be honest. Like,. This all opened up here, and I didn't even know this all opened up here. Like, the bamboo garden, like, they did not a, a great job, like, telling me that this was open. Or if they did, I completely missed it. Drive me nuts. It's so hard to catch some of these bugs, man. Like, almost entirely unreasonably difficult. See? They did the thing again. It's like hiding half in the... 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 Freaking lip there, dude. freaking bogus. I need to stop approaching from that one angle, because I feel like if you go at them straight, of course, they're going to notice you faster, but if you approach them from the back, you have a higher chance of catching them. But, like, they, they disappear, and then, like, you're, you're SOL uh, for, you know, the rest of your night, because you missed it. Oh, maybe it's full. Let's just go back now. It's frustrating, dude. Catch rates are so bad. It's like wanting to complete like the museum and stuff like that seems like such a hassle. But like, I need to catch this stuff so I can help level up the town. Is like the part that's killing me because it's like, dude, it's like I need these guys. I'm gonna sell the tight normal and see how much it's worth. Um, because like you know you need the the points so you can upgrade the town, dude. And it's just like Jesus. And I think that's why they put so much into the, um, everything else, and why the museum itself is only worth, you know, each entry is only worth three points. It's because it's really not all that great. Which is me wondering, like, once you get all the upgrades and all that stuff, like, is that really the, that's probably the key point there, is, uh, once you level up the temple and you get everything catching level up, that's a float trap, that's cool. Completely useless, and I'm never gonna use it. But uh, excuse me. It's the most expensive bug I caught. Is that maple leaf cutter at silver. Nice. Ranching, large feather, truffle oil. And, uh, get some bank here. Farming. Um, one thousand for osmium sake. That was another thing I wanted to check out. Was uh. How good that was. So, as I said, we're gonna save. We're gonna pop back to the main menu real quick. And, uh. We're gonna reload. Yeah, so we're still on version 1.0 946. Um. I'm hoping we get up to 1.1 here soon. PC might already be at it. Um, I'm not sure. This is how I'm playing on an Xbox Series X. We, uh... 
that's what I play all my games on, honestly. It's mostly because I really like the Xbox controller. That's what all my friends are on. And it's convenient. I don't want to have 15 different... You know. I'm thinking some spicy food. Let me see if we had the ingredients for red curry. Oh, woman after my own heart. Oh, that's right. I married her already. <laughs> I love spicy food, by the way. Please tell me it's a sunny day and not a windy day. Thank you. What's this? Oh! Oh! Yo, what? Stray gave me an insect house, bro? What? Yo! That's insane! That's crazy! Hate that those look like they're ready for like day multiple days. Yeah, I definitely have a sprinkler that's like tripping out down here. Cool. Bunch of tomato jams. Hey, that kimchi. Okra kimchi's ready. Can I I can't age this. Make like taro juice wine? No. Probably made aged sake for like an absolute insane amount of money. Make aged sake. Let's uh let's put a couple of them in there. Why the hell not, dude? Oh, there's another gardenia, honey. Nice. We're almost through our all of our gardenias. Kimchi sold for seven hundred and fifty dollars. This is a gold white truffle. This is about to be worth probably well over three thousand. Hey, can that sprinkler shut up? It's annoying. Reloaded the game to fix one bug and got another one. So it's a sunny day, which means we're gonna be able to go and miss all of the other insects that uh. Are either not gonna spawn or gonna notice me instantaneously and run away. Yeah, see, because now my batteries are procting. Actually, popping. So. We're gonna do some more uh, grass today, too. Our money is extremely good. Like, we're doing uh, super well. Disperse a little better. Thank you. I'm just gonna cut the pig in as I wait for you guys to actually separate yourselves. Cool. Now, hopefully, my sturgeons will actually pop uh, more than just four out of ten. about it earlier though uh with like stardew valley and stuff like that like it's so like i get why the 1.6 update uh like what one of the the facts of life about being a uh, player on xbox is the fact that updates usually make it to us last and i mean there's a reason behind that and that's simply because microsoft is a little bit of a turd when it comes to uh updates on the xbox for, the, for those of you who are not familiar with how uh, Microsoft runs it, there's like a huge, like it just takes forever 
to get the damn update through. I have not been refilling my amaranth. Um, because they just, they want to check it for bugs and make sure they're not putting any malware on the Xboxes. And it's like, I'm sorry, but if a developer has routinely shown that they're, they're not doing that, like, maybe you should shut up and let the update go through. Because I've seen games that are, like, broken, like, actively broken, and the devs are like, yo, we're sorry that it's taken so long to get this update to you guys, but Microsoft is literally, like, shit in the bed right now. 225. Remember, you can like something and actively criticize it. I know it's crazy. Some people don't have the uh, the mental capacity to understand that concept. I e all the people who argue online uh, for nothing. Well, you see. I know it's crazy. I can like something and criticize it too. Some of my favorite games. There, there are some. Some things that I find as glaring issues that I will always call out. Very rarely will I ever play a game and be like, oh, this game is, like, absolutely perfect. Like, this game is an absolute, like, 10 out of 10, literally nothing wrong. There is, uh... Probably only one game that I would really consider, like, my true, um... Like a true 10 out of 10 for me and that's probably dead space i think that's one of the only games i've ever played where i'm like yo this game is actually like perfect oh great what have i done what have i done i've now bitten off more than i could chew oh god i did more than i was supposed to guys oh god that was stupid i'm just trying to fill in this little oh one off all right, well, I've bitten off more than I could chew on that one. I've now added more grass than I intended to add. Uh, now I must keep going. I am now a victim of my own hubris. Possibly the pubris, but I'm not sure about that one. But, uh, yeah. Dead Space for me, man. So if you guys haven't watched any of my Dead Space stuff, I played uh, Dead Space 1, 2, and 3, and then I played the remake, which is... Uh, Amazing. Honestly, the remake was... I was... Talking about someone who was a big hater for no reason. I was I was so staunchly against that game. The remake, I was like, Oh, you don't need to remake stuff. Blah, 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 blah. They should just make Dead Space 4. And then I actually watched some of like, the dev stuff. And then I was like, Alright. Y'all convinced me. I was, I was grade A... Hater number one for the Dead Space remake. Like, hands down. I don't think there was a bigger hater than me up until, like, the last moment. Then I played it and loved it. Now, do I love it more than the original, original Dead Space? Oh, about that one. I feel like you're really, really testing the waters with me if you, you know. Well, the new one was very, very good. They're, they're about even in my eyes. They are even in my eyes. Hey, farm's doing so good. Uh, we should have another bundle of crops ready for tomorrow. That'd be cool. Same sprinkler. Should stop sprinkling. That'd be cool. Uh, let's grab these batteries. Sell those. That's an easy 450. Um, we don't necessarily need batteries at the current moment. Um, can I make it over to the lab real fast? Ugh, my nose. Yeah, just love it. Oh, they're decorating for the spooky season. Okay, so upgrade produce quality. We just need gold kelp essence. Um... We have a ton of. We can get this all up to gold. Would be pretty cool. Um, and then develop equipment. I want the auto feeder. 
15 grand, 15 grand, 100 scrap, 20 hay, 5 silver, 2 batteries. We can easily do that. We got all that. And there's the ultimate scarecrows, which is a 19 by 19 radius, which is crazy. Auto trash collector uh, automatically collects trash. We don't really need that. And the forage, we don't really need that either. Um, Automate fertilizes, plant seeds, and harvest crops to empty tilled soil. I don't really see the reason behind that either. Auto harvest might be kind of cool, but it's also not super hard. This is all there for, I guess, people who really want um, access to all of the automation. I like a little bit of automation, but I want to actually be involved with my farm, because what the hell else are you going to do? If you automate your entire farm, like, literally, what do you do the rest of your day? <laughs> there's, there's nothing to do. Uh, but the auto feeder will be nice for winter. Uh, so it's two battery, five. Okay. Might not have the silver kelp essence for that. Although I feel like we got a lot of silver kelp essence. We didn't didn't actually get that much. So I'll need five though. It's pretty easy. Yep, I got the five. So we'll grab that. Um, grab out our batteries. I needed pretty much all my scrap, which sucks. I'm gonna pull some. It was scrap, and then what the hell else did I need? I don't know. We'll have to go back tomorrow and check on it. Um, I'm going to start making more scrap again, though. Just waiting for nightfall to hit so I can go bug hunting again. Um, shit. I need... I'm gonna need, uh, uh... Let's go look for some scroungeable flowers. Um, I'm going to need some flowers to help make, uh... Bug sense. So I can try to make myself a little bit harder to... Find. Because that's the last thing I want, is to bumble across the bugs I need and they just run. <laughs> My cat's snoring right now. Like, what the hell was that noise? Good old kitty snoozing. I woke up this morning, almost went right back to bed. We're talking, I slept for 10 hours last night. Where is it? There we go. Let's move you over here. Okay. Oh, cool, I can make some more. The, um, currently, the Rove Beetle is my absolute number one catch. The Rove Beetle and the Atlas Moth are my two, two bigums. Currently, those are the two that I want the absolute most. It's nighttime now, though, so we are gonna... I wanna see if I can't catch an Atlas Moth. The Rove and the Atlas are my two... It's not going to help me necessarily with the Atlas Moth, but if there's anything else, I don't want to accidentally scare it off. I also hate that there's no in-between speed. I can't just make my guy walk. And face stink bug. That's why it didn't run for me instantaneously. Um, it's a wasp up there. I don't really necessarily care about the wasp. Uh, let's come down here. Because also one of the issues I face now is uh, it's a Luna Moth. Luna Moth's good catch. A couple hundred bucks. Uh, I don't see any Atlas Moths over here. That's kind of a disappointment. Um, we're going to go check 
the hardwood area real quick. This is not the way to the hardwood area. I don't know why I went that way. Uh, there's nothing there. <laughs> Actually, there is. I just went the... I wasn't south enough for that. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Gotcha. Okay. Atlas Moth collected. Let's, uh... Let's head to town now. They could have only seen one rove beetle, and it instantaneously, like, bolted from me. I did not get any chance to try and catch it. Um... Looking very cautiously. You're not a, you're just a regular moth, aren't you? Yeah, just a regular moth. <laughs> Nothing wrong with being an everyday average Joe Moth. Joe Moth man. Let's eat another bug scent. The problem is, is they hide, like a lot of them sit completely still, and it makes them very hard to see. Um, and that's really problematic, because if they're sitting completely still, and I haven't seen them a lot, I'm not familiar with their model, I don't think I should go right here if I want to go to the graveyard. I think I need to approach it from the, so uh, from the south, like I'm doing now. There's usually a spider sitting inside the damned um, he approaches slowly that's just a centipede that sucks uh, nothing else here let's go into town proper there's usually nothing that spawns here either Halloween decorations are actually making it harder to try and find stuff, but, uh, you know, we don't try. See, they mark it as town, that they're in town, but I don't, I think there's only, like, one spawn point that they actually have, because I don't know what they, like, like, this is town, okay, but, like, how, how much of this is town, you know what I mean? Which is why I find pretty much everything in the graveyard. I don't think their spawn zones are super great. Spawn rates and spawn zones really stink. Actually, hold up. We're going to pause for just a second. I'm going to load up the wiki. I want to reload the damn wiki. Uh, Creatures. Hey, stop. Stop that. Insects. Um... 5%, ooh. May spawn all day, others spawn only during the daytime, at night, uh, so season or weather. With rare insects appearing less frequently than more common ones, for most spawn locations, the rarity distribution is as follows. 50% for common, 20 for uncommon, 15% for rare, 10 for super rare, and 5% for legendary. Um... So we're looking for, let's say, the Rove Beetle. Let me scroll here for a little bit. Uh, I passed it. Maybe not Rove Beetle. Sunny, rain, or storms. Let's click on Rove Beetle here. Um, with a bug net or insect trap, can be found through catching. Rove beetles can be donated to the museum for three points, can be shipped or sold at the bee shack, it can be used for cooking or crafting, can be bred through the insect farm for two days. It can be gifted as a universally hated uh, gift. Eleanor's the only person that likes it. Neutral for Grog. Um, I was hoping there was more information on the rove beetle and its habits. So it's fall and winter. Uh, it's a rare spawn. Difficulty hard. <sighs> oh, shit. That sucks. Um, so the rove beetle is just 
going to be a pain in my ass, essentially. Um, can you stop loading shit on this screen? That's why I hate wikis. So Rove Beetle is rare. Fuck. So the Rove Beetle, it turns out, only has like a very low chance of spawning. And it looks like there's only X amount of, like, spawns. Um, so he only has a 15% chance of showing up, which is really shit. Um, as it were. So, that, that hurts my feelings. So... The chance of catching one in one of my traps is probably really low. Um. Oh, that was stupidly. I don't know why he did that. Um. I'm gonna knock a couple of these up. Oh, of course, my inventory is freaking full, dude. What am I inventory full of? Let me sell you. Extra areas to put these in to try and spread out. So I don't think they spawn in that area. I'm trying to, I'm trying to catch them in. Hey, can I set these down over here? That'd be really. Oh, I can. You know where all of the rare insects seem to keep spawning is the freaking graveyard. Um. So I think I'm just gonna have to spread out ground traps like everywhere as I attempt to catch oh. I got your ass <laughs> I live by a uh, very particular philosophy uh, the less you look for something, the easier it is to find. Which hasn't helped in terms of, uh, you know, finding happiness in my life. But, uh... <laughs> oh. Bam! Bam! That's another one done. A tap. It's hardly... Hardly interesting or useful, but, uh... uh... Farming, let's put the tap up. Let's sell. Um, except for that Atlas Moth. I think I have to donate that guy. Um... So we'll just go to bed. Heck yeah, dude. I'm so excited about that. 3,680 for a gold white truffle. Chewy. Pumpkins are worth good money. The ochre kimchi, 862. Yeah, taro root really ain't worth nothing either. Now, by sheer volume, if you were to do like cranberries, let's say cranberries or taro root in high volume, I'm curious how much money you'd make. We've cleared some areas. We've cleared some areas. Oh, we got some, we got some stuff. It's nice to have some peace and quiet after a long day here. When I was living in, there were always people everywhere. Oh, we got some, we got some run around to do now. We got some, we got some business to take care of. Uh, just want to be a quick brother. Victory dance to drop you a little note. Got to admit, the view's pretty spectacular from the top. Oh, it's jackass. You know, if you weren't cheating, um, I'd come burn your house down. Because, Bobby, in fact, you are, in fact, a cheater. It's wild. There's no way you got a variety bonus with six of the same item. I'm sorry. It doesn't work like that. Some sort 
Carol Root Juice. Call me, call me crazy. Dude, this Osmium Aged Barley Beer is about to be worth so much money. Um, actually, let me double check the Atlas Moth. Oh, he's already been donated. Okay, well, I don't need to hold on to you anymore. You're getting sold. The sprinkler is obviously still glitched. Um, whatever. Harvest. Got some beets. We got some crumbers. Love me some crumbers. Some egg plants. Can't pick them all up because my inventory is full. Um, grape, grape. Literally one bronze egg point. Guess what? That's extra forty-one dollars. A forty-one doll hairs, if you wish. Whoops! I have all these gold. Huh? Well, guess what? I'll just use you. I don't really care. So I did do an extra barley harvest. There we go. Wicked. guys oh it's a we, we made some big ups on this stream I didn't expect us to make I'll be real with y'all it's about to, this this day about to be crazy that's uh that's one of the things about this game that I really love is like on occasion like you just get these moments where like everything starts happening at one time Let all the animals out. I gotta go clear up my inventory. But like you just you get moments where just like so much happens at one time. And it's so exciting. It's all my sturgeons, there's my broken sprinkler. Try to get that fixed. I was gonna say, oh, sell those extra batteries. Don't do that. Don't don't sell 20 batteries. Although the money would be really good. Don't sell 20 batteries. Find me more truffles, Mr. Pig. Make Papa proud. Pig named Big. So I messed up its name. Dog eggs? What? Somebody laid two eggs. Oh, yeah. It's good. It's very good. Again, sorry about all the sniffling and sneezing and uh, whatever and whatnot, guys. Really didn't want to miss stream today. I really wanted to play some Coral Island. So. That was not going to let me be in sick, interfere with our plans. Oh, 20 hay. That was the last thing I needed. Let's go grab that. Develop that equipment, and then we will be good. We will be 
is super good. Super excited. We got the two night insects we needed for the uh freaking stuff. And it looks like it's done. It did a lot more than just uh completing that offering. Purchase, you can now craft the item. Nice. Got that done. Let's go drop everything off at home. Oh, we'll look into crafting the auto feeder. A bunch of, bunch of resources. Oh, that's right, it gives you one for free. They're kind of giga chads like that. That was with the arrow. You guys. Oh, that's what. Okay. Auto feeder is installed. Um, at least in the chicken coop. Um, I'm hoping it's not too expensive to craft. Silver kelp scrap. All right, it's not expensive to craft at all. I just need silver, uh, silver kelp and scrap, which we'll have to go get some more silver. But I'm not too, uh, I'm not stressing over that at all, honestly. Choy. Drop that off. We gotta go start exploring, guys. We gotta. We're also not not particularly done with all the good stuff. We, we got more good stuff going on. Guys, we're about to grab the last of our hard, hardwood needed for the house upgrade. Like, right now. <laughs> like, like we are about to have that. There it is. Oh, I couldn't have got seven on the last one. We could have been upgrading the house today, too. All right, let's try to find all those zones. Yeah, because look, this is all open now. I don't quite know what the significance of all this opening is right now you know what I mean like I don't I don't know what this what this all means there's more hardwood there's a bunch of stone over there it's pretty cool um, I can cut around up here This looks like the dig site. There's a bunch of bananas laying around. Um, monkey up there. Hey, bud. Like, I'm way off the map now, dude. What the hell? What is this? Mahogany seed. It's all hardwood. Yeah. So this is the hardwood forest. Um, we might as well chop down a few trees while we're here and gather up some extra hardwood because that would be that's a poplar seed. We might grow a couple of these on the uh, farm too. For uh, then we'll put taps on them. Let's see if we can get anything. All right, so we got access to hardwood, which is, uh, you know, would have been useful a while ago. 
Um, it's another fishing zone. That's a ladybug. It's not anything special. Um, King Tan, you don't understand what's being said. Tan hanging out. Big monkey boy. So it doesn't even like that's not even shown on the map. I didn't even, even think all this would be back here, honestly. I mean, I'm not even getting stoned from any of this. Fossil. See if I get anything good. Uh, oh, some fossil bones. I'm wondering if this is worth checking out every couple of days. For uh fossils and whatnot. Okay, so we got access to the hardwood, which is actually super cool. It's going to make doing uh, a lot of the builds for the game a lot easier. Because we will now have access to the hardwood that allows us to just build easier. Look, I, already, I have 87 hardwood in my inventory. Um, that's really cool. That's really, really cool, actually. I'm super happy about that. Oh, inventory's full. Drop off all this wood. Uh, drop off all those fossils. Hi, honey. I'm about to, about to go nuts here. Um, Those we'll grab these sturgeons. So no, I didn't plant any new seeds either. What an absolute doofus! Oh, we got time for it. Taro root juice. Um, we'll keep taro roots kind of on one here. have the most amount of time. See, we only got six days, so we have to just do whatever is available for six days. Uh, let's do... Uh, we'll just do a bunch of basil. Do 48 basil. Why not? Me, I have the problem. See, like, 48 basil seeds is still only $960, dude, like, the basil's got a pretty, pretty solid turnaround, honestly. That's a pretty, pretty solid, especially for only a five-day grow. Eventually. <laughs> I really hope the carpenter's open tomorrow because that would really put a wrench in my planes and make me sad. From other sap, catching one moth, fishing, 3600 from Sturgeon, dude. Every few, every few days I get $3,600 just from straight Sturgeons. $1,700 from an Osmium aged barley beer. That's 
That's crazy. <laughs> Pickle back choy. Pickle back choy go crazy. 454, dude. I like it. I feel all my caffeine starting to starting to work on me. I saw Sally falling on our farm outside. I hope nothing major was destroyed. Ah, God bless America. What the hell was I growing here? Was that melons? I can't be melons. Sprinklers! Shut up! Hey yo, we got the bug house. Just gotta find a bug to put in there now. A rare bug would be preferable, but you know, I'm not so. Uh... Nope, you start putting barley back in. Anything less than an osmium taro root is worth uh, basically nothing. Go. Basically, unless it's osmium level fruit veg, I don't want it. Gold egg plants can go. So I'm not I'm not the pickiest man in the world, but uh. Oh, we got rid of all the gardenias. Um, I still don't know what I can do with pumpkins yet. Um, I might try to make some pumpkin juice out of the. Oh, make actual pumpkin juice. I need to water these trees. I think I'll be able to get one more run of fruits. They don't, uh. Your chances of getting high high tier stuff is pretty low. I mean, I got them set up to gold right now, and I still am like barely getting golds. But no osmium tier fruits. We might go nuts uh, with fruit trees uh, coming uh, during when spring comes back around. We might go. We might go a bit harder in the paint with the. Uh, saplings and trees and stuff like that. Farm's looking greener! I'm getting there. I'm getting there. No, I just need to find a damn bug I wanna... It's actually worth some cash oil to put in there. One thing I appreciate... Uh, about uh, Coral Island and Stardew Valley, it uh, can be said for both, is how consistent animals are at providing income. Like when I played uh, played co-op with my buddies in uh, Stardew Valley, I was in charge of animals. Animals became my... Animals and fishing were like my two big things. And then they did a lot of the plant growing and stuff like that. They did most of the mining. Uh, operations, but I was in charge of pretty much all the other weirdness. <sighs> Which was fun. That was that was my favorite part about co-op uh, for Stardew Valley was the ability to distribute our time and energy so that way, you know, everybody had more time to do the things they wanted. Um, because you weren't uh, hemmed up trying to do everything in a single day because of course you know you were everybody was playing together so you were able to work as a team and get stuff done it was it was great it was great okay so I don't remember check the carpenter open at nine okay let's just grab that. I think I need stone 
maybe gold bars. I don't know. We're just going to go up there right now. I got money out the nose. We're, we're cashed up. I think it's 120,000 for the next house upgrade. That's a violin beetle. I was like, what the hell? Good looking bug. There's probably a resource I need. I just don't have it on me. Ma'am. 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 That's the wrong. Ten gold bars. Okay, I don't have those on me right now. Let me go grab those. I don't even think I have ten gold bars. I think I've got gold ore I can turn into gold bars. God, I wish I was a little bit faster. Should have saved some of that coffee. <laughs> coffee was just so good for money, though, dude. So I've got six, and I need, uh, I need four more. Can I get those done today? an osmium amaranth flower is only like 95 dollars there are there are some things in this game that really just are not worth a lot they're just they're just not and that's something one must learn to accept all right so bugs is going to be a little bit more irritating i think in terms of catching um i do know we're just gonna have to kind of run the gauntlet here. Um, maple leaf cutters were worth quite a bit. Um, you also want them at the same rarity level, I believe, to be able to spit out a consistent uh, rarity. Which makes things a little bit more difficult, um, honestly. Bogus. Absolute horseshit. God, I hate how that works, dude. So I got two of the pipe fine swallow tails. I might just go throw you guys in there for now. Um, we may not be able to. If I would have known I needed those extra gold. Um, it's an Osmium Grasshopper. It's the first I've ever seen of that. Um, let's see, the Carpenters, you guys close at 5 p.m. We might be able to get all of our gold. Um, we might be able to get all of our gold. I'm just going to put those in there for now. Until I can find something of higher quality. It's, uh, silly to leave that open and doing nothing, you know what I mean? When we can, uh, we can easily do that. And, uh, even if it's only a little bit of money, it's a little bit of money. You know what I mean? It's not, uh, no, it's not the best, but, oh, that Luna Moth would have been, went crazy. Um, okay, we're just gonna go basically stand by the gold bars and hope I can get down to... Uh, get those done and then get to the carpenter before it closes. Man, sprinkler, so cool, bro. Oh my god, no, this is probably gonna be a. We'll get it done on the next day. So I'll be right back. I'm gonna go use my boys' room.
back. Oh yeah, yeah. No, we're we have we got two more of the gold bars we need. We're not uh, we're not we're not getting those anytime soon. Sad face. Very sad face. You know what? It's gonna be like that though. But you know what we can do? We can order some more grass. You guys like grass? I like grass. That's why I'm covering my farm in it. Gotta, gotta make more money so I can buy more grass. I realistically have no clue what I'm doing. I can't believe I'm as weird and stupid as, uh, as I am, honestly, frankly. <laughs> Do another hundo. As I said, we're, we're to the point where we're making tons of money. Guess what? I want to decorate the farm. I'm tired of the farm looking uh, plain Jane. Nothing wrong with a plain Jane farm, but maybe I just want it to look a little cooler. You know what I mean? And I want it grassed. I want a grass farm. I'm tired of looking at all this dirt. Now, it's sad is when I put a building down and it's going to like destroy a huge swath of it, but you know what? We, we don't. Uh, we don't talk about that until it happens. Ironically, this is probably where I'm gonna put the stable. And once we get the house upgrade, I can get the uh, we'll get the stable, and then we'll get a horse, so I can have a another animal and fill out fill out a little bit more of the farm. It'll look nice. Is this the gameplay you guys show up for? Is this is this the excitement? that we wish to perceive. Now, can I do something with the damn... Thank you. A little jazz piano, bro. What the hell? I got another sneeze. This is misery. I'm in misery right now. Holy crap, dude. Just, uh, I think we're just gonna hit the sack. Oh. Uh, uh. I got another sneeze cog, guys. I'm dying right now. I'm literally dying. We'll, we'll probably end in, a, end in about a half hour here. I'm reaching my, my upper limit for uh, stream at the current moment. Morning, honey. It's really nice to wake up next to you. I don't think I'll ever get tired of it. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm reaching my limit. You think 10 hours of sleep would have done me a little bit more justice? Uh, the answer is... No. Did I accidentally take my morel mushroom out of here and then... Oh, no, it's full. Okay. I got to sell those. Like, I've... For the past two days, I've slept for, like, ten hours. And it's all I want to do again is sleep for another ten hours. But I probably will not be able to achieve that tonight. I don't ever get that much sleep on work nights. And, uh, it'll, uh, well, well, we'll see. You guys might see me online tomorrow. I, uh, I got, I'm, I'm pretty staunch about going to work while I'm sick. Just because I really don't want to get my coworkers sick. Um, un unlike my coworkers, I'm a, I'm a bit nicer of a guy, uh, when it comes to that kind of stuff. Because, one, it really sucks to get sick. 
And two, a lot of them have kids. You know what I mean? It kind of messes, throws a wrench and they're all playing. But, uh... It's because of them and their kids. This is why I'm sick. Like, I legitimately have gotten sick more times at my job than I have, like, ever. In the last two years I've worked there, I've gotten sick more often than not. Like, it's it's miserable, dude. It is it's miserable. I've got COVID, like, three times. I'm working with a bunch of guys who are just like, oh, COVID's not real. You're like, bro, why are you like this? Like last time I caught COVID, it was not good. It was, I was, I was sick. I have no inventory space. Let's go drop some stuff off. Pretty sure my body's almost at a point that if I catch COVID like really bad again, like I, my body might not be able to take it. Sounds kind of grim, but it's uh, it's kind of the truth. You put 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 that much stress on your body multiple times and see what happens. There are people who experience long-term side effects, and I already have a long-term side effect from the first time I got COVID real bad. So I really do not want any more. I'm almost wondering if I got, like, a compromised immune system, because, like, I feel like I get sick a lot easier these days. And if that's the case, dude, I'm gonna have to go find me a new job, because working with these guys, dude, these are the type of dudes, he'll, he'll come in, guys will come in literally snot oozing down their face, hacking up a lung, like, dying, like, they'll, they'll be pale as a ghost, and these guys will still show up to work. And I'm like, you got PTO? Yeah, I just don't want to miss any days. Bro, you're literally dying. And that same dude, a couple hours later, first break hits, dude's outside smoking a cigarette. I'm like, bro, you, you literally are wheezing. As you're walking around, he's like, oh, I'm scared. I need my fix. And I'm like, okay, bro. Like, I'm not going to carry you out of here if you collapse. Just letting you know. I will call your wife, though, if you die. Call her and tell her what an idiot you are, but that's, you know, neither here nor there. Just inventory. No, long, long story short, though. Please, if you're sick, stay the fuck home. Sincerely, from a dude who gets sick all the time because of people who just don't know how to, like, keep their asses home. Excuse me. Alright, let's head back up to the carpenter. After close today, I'm gonna lose my mind. Okay, no. it's like Thursday or Friday they're closed. Two furnished rooms with hardwood cribs on the second floor enables the ability to have children. There you go. We're gonna have first thing in the morning. Should be done in a couple of days. Controller batteries are low. Well, it wouldn't be one of my streams if that was uh, that didn't happen. Fortunately, my other batteries are charged, but it doesn't mean I have to crawl underneath my desk um, because you know outlets and such. I'm now foaming at the mouth for this upgrade. You guys have no idea. So excited. So excited. I'm almost willing to speed time up for the next couple of days to like, we'll have a couple of super fast days. How do I do that? Oh, we're already at 100%. <laughs> we're, already, we're already moving as fast as we can do. Oh, I can change my movements! Stop. 
I didn't know I could do all this. Hey guys, um, we haven't, uh, been in the menus in a while, eh? <laughs> Hold on, is there any other shit I'm missing? Dyslexic font, that's cool. Colorblind mode. HUD scale. Yeah, we didn't do anything. We're already moving at, like... So this is the, technically, the fast speed. We're moving at 100%. My buddy plays on 50% speed, and I kind of looked at him like he was nuts. I was like, bro, what are you doing? Days already feel like they take long enough. Like, how do you, like, what do you, what do you do for an entire in-game day? <laughs> like, what do you do? All right, so we're about to go nuts -oh what's -oh. That's really not the thing I wanted to do. So now, honestly, the big, huge upgrade's been done. Um, well, I don't want to take on take us under 7,000, so we'll wait a couple of days before we start buying more grass. As I said, we almost got this one whole corner. One whole corner. Probably 100, 150 more. And we'll be done. But, uh, yeah. We really... We ain't got much, much life happening. Uh, I did want to check relationship with my sister-in-law's up. We're at uh, six stars right now. That's nice. I like how it still quantifies them as like single. It's like that's that's cool, but um, I'm I'm taken. Uh, since last longer while catching, that's pretty good. Selling price of all insects. Yeah, let's grab that. I just got the insect house thing, so I feel like that'll be a good, uh, good upgrade. Extra twenty five percent. Yeah, you sort of. We're sort of hitting a point where like we've got everything so well taken care of. I just don't know what to do. Aged mayonnaise. Um, we just don't have the most to to do each day. Can I make some Osmian level pickled kim uh, eggplant kimchi? There we go. I don't like having an open aging barrel. It's not doing anything, you know what I mean? So. Okay. As I said, the next couple of harvests, we might keep all the gold tier stuff as well. That I can keep through winter. Um, we'll probably be hitting winter in probably the next year. Actually... Because I really want the, the tier 2 house, uh, we might end up streaming a little bit longer today. I might might keep myself upright a little bit longer. I know I was saying earlier that I'm feeling like I'm at my limit, but uh, I think the, the prospect of more cool, cool stuff happening is really kind of giving me a little bit of a boost. I really should go grab myself another beverage real quick, though. One must stay hydrated. Let's so check this beach out real quick. I mean, during winter, we'll be through all of the um, the diving stuff in like a week or two in winter. You know what I mean? We're not gonna. It's not gonna take us all winter to blast through all that stuff. So we'll be we'll be through pretty much all of that in winter. So I'm just trying to parse out content, guys. I really don't want Coral Island to end. But we also might, uh, as I said, I want to hit uh, the next town rank. There's the tree planting festival, which I think unlocks a new area when you're done. I don't know. Um, I don't know anybody who's hit year three my buddy is behind me in time actually um well he does slower days so his days take much longer than mine so i uh obviously move faster than he does oh <gasps> fuck yeah That's what I'm talking about. i knew putting putting these in one of these 
areas where I kept spotting rares was gonna come in handy eventually. Not really catching anything rare over here, but the Widow is another one of the ones I need for the museum. So it's one more um, notch on the museum belt. Gotta love seeing the town decorated though. Makes me so happy. Although Halloween is not my favorite season, um, I do enjoy the overall energy that comes from Halloween. I mostly live vicariously through people. I don't like dressing up and doing all that stuff, so um, I do like seeing other people happy, though, and other people enjoying themselves. Every year I always, you know, enjoy scrolling the internet and uh, looking at people's, like, really fun and interesting costumes. It's people, people, man, the creativity of a lot of folks uh, never ceases to amaze me. Edgar Allan Poe is still one of my favorites. Imagine Edgar Allan Poe, but in fishnets and uh, stilettos, and you pretty much got the whole, pretty much got the whole image, really. I mean, I don't know what else you want. Like, that's perfection at its finest. Hit the sack. Ugh. That is not fun, guys. We can. We can just go to bed. My excitement is getting the best of me. Cool. Nice. Oh, was there anything new here I wanted to take a look at? Nah. Feels so late. Yeah, it's 6 a.m., honey. I get up earlier than that. I have to do my reading inside soon. I usually get up for work around 5 a.m. Blue collar is all cool and all that until you uh, realize you gotta wake up at the literal ass crack of dawn every day to go make another man uh, filthy rich. Great, great. There's also, uh, I'm pretty sure most most folks are gonna resonate with what I'm, the words that are about to come out of my mouth. But there's nothing better than having someone who doesn't really do any work show up and tell you that like you're not working hard enough. You guys ever experience that indigent level of rage when someone's like, yeah, you're not a. Uh, you're not working hard enough. You're not working fast enough. And then you're like, aren't you the owner of this company? Like, you've not invested enough back in this company to allow me to do the thing you want me to do. And they go, wow, that's crazy. Anyways. So you're lazy and inconsiderate then. And I'm like, what? So a couple of, a couple of those so I can see the cost analysis. Here, some more train barriers. We'll end up getting one more run of cranberries before all said and done. Okay, as I said, we are gonna keep golds uh, just so I can. I uh, want to pad out my uh, inventory of consumable goods here into. Uh, Winter. It does mean I'm gonna have a more full inventory, but it is what it is. I don't have a lot in terms of flowers. I didn't really kind of plan that one out too hot, but um, there's really if nothing I can plant there. 
that's gonna fall into uh, disarray, but that's okay. Within uh, the first couple of weeks of winter, we'll probably burn through most of my uh, reserve fruits, veg, and flowers, which this is fine. Why I've built up such a big inventory of stuff is so I can I can do that and uh, not have to worry about it. Man, that sprinkler is driving me nuts. I'm not backing out and doing anything about it though because we already did one one reset, and I'm not doing it a second time. So we get to deal with the sprinkler. get a bit more time in on stream today um we could probably get to probably actually get to winter um we're kind of moving through these last couple of days because i don't see any reason not to sit then move through days quickly at this point Like, yeah, I can sit around for a few extra hours and goof around, but I just don't even go in there and get their eggs. I just don't see a reason for it. There's no penalty to progressing time, you know what I mean? There's not... You don't have to have a, a day that runs for 45 minutes. I do not understand... Like, I'm at a point where if I was to sit here for 45 minutes, I would turn the game off. You know what I mean? Like, I would just be so bored if each day was 45 minutes long. Like, real time. There is there is literally no recourse for having days that long. Like, what are you doing for 45 minutes in a single day in this game? Like, if you were manually farming, doing everything manual, like, and I'm talking... If you're straight up just like, hey, yo, we're gonna... I'm not gonna use automatic sprinklers. I'm not gonna use any of that stuff. Like, that would make sense. But, like, if you have your whole farm automated, what are you doing? Like, I'm at the point where I don't really have that much to do. There's no real fish to catch. There's a couple of bugs left to catch, but that's about it. That's the reason I'm grassing the farm. And we're decorating the farm. is because, like, we're running out of stuff to do. <laughs> We are legitimately running out of things to do, so that's why I'm, like, doing stupid shit. It's like, just to buy some time, dude. Like, we need to kill time during the days. That's why I looked and was like, oh, I can't make the days go any faster? Okay. Um. We'll buy some... We'll buy some more grass. We'll just do, uh, we'll do 50. 51, I guess. We're gonna work on... I guess building our cash back up, I don't really, I think we got one of the, the, the largest ticket items in the game, and that's the house upgrade. I do not think that there's any singular item worth more than the house, uh, the final house upgrade. Honestly, I... As I said, we'll do the, the stable for the horse. That'll be cool. Um... Oh, there it is. <laughs> Had a lovely trip. So I've also been on a quest, 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 for um, batteries over the last. Uh, just put them in backwards, dude. Why did I do that? Um, I've been on a quest for a good, good rechargeable batteries. <laughs> That are not like Duracell or Energizer or something like that. I've realistically not had the best time with Energizer and Duracell. They have a tendency to overcharge real bad and die out after a few months. Um, I've been using this other brand that they've been super good. Like they run really well. I also bought a fancy, fancy ass charger. I've got a super nice high quality charger now. Um, where are these batteries? They're EBLs, dude. These things are sick. Like, they... 
they are they run so well. Like they run down to literally the last minute and hold charge for such a long time. So, all right, I'm gonna go grab a beverage real quick. I will be right back. Ugh, we're back. Strawberry banana body armor. It's very high in vitamin C. Now, whether it's kind of hotly debated whether or not uh, vitamin C actually does anything for you when you're sick. I would rather get all the vitamins and minerals absolutely injected into me to make me, you know, make me feel better. And even if it placebo affects you, you know what I mean? Even if I, like, kind of trick myself into feeling better, then what's what's wrong with that? Also, I get a tasty beverage, so. Well, we're actually up here for a very particular reason. There's those pink mantises. I think it's an orchid mantis. Oh. Also, lunamoths. We're looking for rarer uh, bugs to put into our bug uh, farm. Oh. A little late releasing the Zanette. It's a maple leaf cutter, ain't it? Don't oh, pipe mine, swallowtail. I got two silvers, uh, silver. Pipe time, pipe, pipe mine, swallowtails. Bug farm. I don't remember what the like. I don't know what their cost is. Like, you know, if I'm gonna actually make any decent money from them or not. Let's. Uh, yeah, we'll check all of our bug stuff. We'll just do a quick roundabout here. As I said our days are pretty much ending. Our days at six o'clock because there's really no reason not to. Hey kids. Hi sis. Mr. Soda's the oncoming winner. You should too. Heater, blankets, what else do I need? Winter on a tropical island really doesn't seem like all that bad. I'm impressed that this island actually gets all the seasons open oh, inventory's full. <laughs> you know you get you guys get all four seasons here. See where I live we have five seasons. We also have construction season. Um really a terrible sight to behold. There's a road near me that they've been working on for uh, a while now, actually. In fact, they have one, like the eastbound side of it is open, but the westbound is closed, and it's gotten to the point where they now have to um, leave police officers watching the westbound because people kept jumping the barricades. And, uh, there's a couple of accidents, and it was like, hey, bro, maybe, maybe finish the road you guys started working on months ago, and people would be okay. They are, in fact, not working on shit. Those sons of bitches ain't making, they're doing nothing, honestly. You want the, you want the honest truth. They, there's not been a road crew out there for so long. That's the last of the blueberry wine, dude. That is nuts. That is nuts. Alright, so we'll probably go a couple days longer. Just because I want the house upgrade. You know what I mean? Like, we're, we're so close. Well, the watermelons ain't too bad. Watermelons ain't too bad. 
just have such a long grow time. I think the... It's on the 28th for the Halloween. You know what that means? We have to repair the inn for winter. Ugh. Yep, 28th is a spooky festival. I really just don't want to sneeze anymore. You know what I mean? Like, I really would just like to just... I'm making the part of the beer one out. I would like to just stop sneezing today would be the optimal course of action. It would make me so happy. I have to go blow my nose here in a second. It's very clogged up. I mean... <laughs> ah! There we go. Hey, cool. It's rice. Yeah. Oh, it's very full again. Now that we just added rice to my already disgustingly filled. Here, I'll sell just the regular one. Because my already overflowing inventory needs another three slots taken up. There you go, look, there's a, just made another slot. Means I can put the rice up here now. And this can come down here. See? Look. I'm, I'm making all the room. Oh. Got sturgeon babies. let all the animals out. I'm gonna go blow my nose. Should do some day cool before I start streaming, honestly. Woo! Hey yo! It's very full. Oh, of course it is. Oh, what's going? What's going? Oh, there was cranberries out here I didn't even collect. Damn, dude. What am I doing? Now, I'm curious if there's any winter saplings. I don't think so. I'm hoping I can buy, like, I have something for winter seed that I can buy. That would be, um, that'd be really cool. I think I'll get one more harvest of fruit out of that, too. I need to make that other auto feeder for uh, these guys for the barn. That's what I gotta do. That's what I gotta do. We'll probably also go through and um, scythe up a bunch more tall grass for. Uh, hey! Right idea, wrong tool. Yeah, we'll, we'll probably end up doing that too so we can get some more hay. That way I don't have to, uh, we won't have to stress out um, at all for uh, winter. We might already, in fact, have enough, but we will see. Do I have nothing milling? No, I don't. 
I don't particularly relish the fact that nothing's actually there. Yeah, most of the stuff, we'll end up clearing this inventory uh, pretty pretty quickly. Because we've expanded stuff. I mean, we've got just so much extra stuff sitting around. And I think we got one more day on the house expansion. Let me go upstairs. I just want to take a look. I'm pretty sure it's going to be a big deal. Yeah, we got one more day. We got one more day on the on the house. Which is going to be huge. So, yeah, well, uh, I'm going to go blow my nose real quick. When we get back, I'm going to go, we're going to go try to collect a couple hundred more hay. Just get ready for the winter season so that way I ain't got to stress out over it. BRB. Gracious, I tell you what, that was a lot of snot that just came out of me. It was premium. Ugh. More gardenia, honey. Should have, should have planted more flowers. Honestly, I didn't. Uh, I'm gonna run out of flowers faster because I'm only keeping osmium. That's a little bit of a problem, honestly. Oh, stupidly. How do you do that? There we go. Alright, let's go, uh, get some weight. Oh, the sound of the sprinklers is gone. Sorry, no wheat. Two very different things. It's fig. No, up, up, in a wee. Ayo. 
Another Lunamoth? Do you need to catch me another Lunamoth? Bogus. Bogus. Absolute turd farm. Just aim for the big patches of grass, really. I'm not going to go after one and two. Gonna uh, work on doing all this. This is so easy. Crazy to let you do this. This game gives you so many tools at your disposal, it just makes your life so much easier. Like, no, I don't have to throw hay anymore. <laughs> All I need to do is come out here into the wilds and scythe up some grass and we're good. I mean, my, my number of animals has increased since last winter, so of course I have more. I already have a couple hundred sitting in the... Uh, in my chest, and I think my, um, what you call it, is full. My silo, or it's pretty dang close to full. I can plant wild seeds too in, uh, winter. Should have, should have probably been uh, stockpiling those. Caught one. So I have 237A on me currently, which is pretty cool. That's quite a bit. For only a couple of minutes worth of work. Nearly 300. I've only been out here for a couple minutes. Run, little bug. Run! I'm not here for you, anyways. Come up here, get a little bit more. Get up like 300. About this last little patch of grass here and just kind of go crazy. I gotta get uh, maybe hay up to gold tier two. I know. I mean, honestly, it'd just be smarter just to put the camera on him the whole time. Honestly. Nope. I need those. Get back here. He mostly just snoozing most of the time, though. He's just chilling. God, I wish I was asleep. Wake up with a cold on the weekend. What kind of crap is that? It's unfavorable. Fishing leveled up. I haven't done any fishing. It's just selling fish. Your house just got bigger. Suki talked me into wearing a costume for tomorrow's festival. If she's doing it, then I guess I'm in it too. Now I'm against having babies in real life. But I can have babies in this video game. So how does that work exactly? How do I... How do I convince... Uh, I can't believe I'm married to you. I'm so happy. I don't think my heart can contain it. Hey, could you stop saying nice things to me like that? Because, you know. My wife, oh my god, honey, we've been we've been married a while now. We've been married almost a year. I like your enthusiasm. Oh, alright, alright. I'm starting to hurt my own feelings talking to her. 
Alright, I'm gonna talk to her one more time. From anyone who knew more about weird phenomena than me. Very impressive, I have to say. Alright. Yep, that, that hurt my feelings a little bit. I'm walking away now. Uh... <laughs> uh, get ready for the Spooky Day Festival. Join us from 7pm onward. That's, that's tomorrow. It's cool. Alright, now that my feelings are entirely hurt from a fictional woman who told me how much she loves me, uh... I'm gonna go cry in the shower or something now. Aren't video games fun? <laughs> video games are so much fun, guys. It just makes me think of, uh... Like those posts where it's like, men only want one thing, and it's like, you know, so something completely unrelated to what men want. It's like, what men really want. Oh look, my inventory's full, I can't collect all my garlic. Broken sprinkler. Hate it. What kind of animals are we? Broken shit on my farm. What the hell is this? Oh, that's aged sake. That's about to be worth a probably two or three thousand. I think the osmium is worth like seventeen hundred. Like the regular sake was worth like seventeen hundred. Boy, about to go crazy. And there's no reason to plant anything. Because... Uh, it's the end of the, end of the season. I'll water all these, but I think all of these are getting ready to die. There's three on the left here. Fruit trees are looking nice. Remember, they take a month to grow, and then, uh... Oh, a couple of cranberries chilling. Um... Get rid of the damn taro. There we go. So we're gonna just go through, we're gonna handle the rest of the farm real quick, and then we're gonna, I'm gonna go onto the wiki real quick, and I'm gonna see what's up, and how the whole children thing works. I'm imagining it just takes time at this point for you and your significant other to uh, do the need. But yeah, we'll, uh, we'll wrap out fall. Um, I'm thinking, thinking we'll we'll finish up fall here, uh, for this stream, and we'll we'll, we'll be the winner. Again, we only need one snowdrop flower to get us the greenhouse, so I'm wondering if I should buy some seeds beforehand and have some stuff for. Uh, winter that I can uh, stash away in the greenhouse when that's ready because that'd be uh, pretty sweet honestly uh, let's go grab uh, I don't know if these are actually worth anything but hey let's put the eggs in the, in the mayo machines let's go Get everything from these guys um, hopefully I can make that other auto feeder. I 
think I might be like an ingredient off from being able to do that. Let's go drop everything off real quick. Okay, tell you what. Which one of you is it? Fascinating. I was hoping uh, <laughs> removing all of them and putting them back was going to help, but uh, turns out that was a lie. Alright, well, we got the spooky festival tomorrow. That'd be cool. We got Halloween. -y, which is always exciting. Okay, put that there. Um, I'm just gonna sell the fertilizer thing. I don't use fertilizer. That's only worth $98 a piece. That's a little bummer. Not worth anything. Um, alright, I'm gonna, like, walk down here away from the sprinklers. Gonna enjoy a little bit of peace and quiet. Um, let's see. No, that's that's not the right tab. That's not the right tab. Uh, uh, there it is. Um, let's see. Mechanics, relationship, romance. Okay. Stop. Stop. Wiki. Dating. Uh, marriage. Children. Players can have up to two children. Children's skin color and swaddle wrap will look differently based on the character you married to. Per the current version of the game, the infant cannot be interacted with. It is not yet confirmed whether Valentina will count towards this limit if marrying Sookie. Uh, or how children between players in multiplayer mode will be implemented. After having children, the player will continue playing as their character. Children are and will remain NPCs. So... Is that just sort of, uh, huh. Okay. So it doesn't really tell you, um, kind of like how children happen. I think they just sort of, I think it's just going to happen. Uh, uh, Cool. Sounds like the the, the kind of kids mechanic sounds kind of cool. Uh, whoops, I didn't mean to minimize that window. I just wanted to leave it up. Make it work. Schmear. Click back on that. I got so many things open on my computer. Um. Okay. So. We will just have to wait and see what happens, my fine fellows. And uh, hopefully... I want to make my my wife's favorite recipe. We'll use a tarot root for that, because tarot root ain't worth the squat anyways. I love green smoothies, I know you do. I might actually just, I might just Google it on my phone real quick. The wiki didn't have the information I was looking for. I'm going to see if this does. Oh, Coral, Island Having a baby. Upgrade your house fully accept offer when your spouse asks if you want to have children. Okay, that's, that's all I need. 
So she will she will straight up ask me. I like that. So that'll be its own own uh, skinamarink, I guess. Oh, stuff I can pop over here. Cool. Uh, we might make a pass. Um, we're gonna head into town, I guess. We'll try to catch one of the other rare bugs I need. We'll make one more go of it at night here. Um, even though it's been an absolute shit show. We did catch two of the ones I was looking for. So that's pretty cool. Um, unfortunately, I need to catch a second rove beetle. Because the second rove beetle is needed for the museum now. I caught the one for the temple. Um, centipede chill in there. Catch this little bastard. Yoink. Now, the graveyard, being my mortal enemy for bug catching. Approach this slowly. I don't see anything. Okay. Go down to town proper. As I said, we'll do the, we're going to do the Halloween event. And then, uh, yeah, we'll be into winter. Should be cool. Oh, inventory's full. So I'll just head back to the house then. So, let's look at cost. Did I catch any bugs? That's worth 130. I feel like I should uh, toss those into the um, bug bin. They're worth more than the butterflies I got in there right now. Or the moths, or whatever the hell they are. Yeah, swallowtail butterflies aren't worth as much. We'll put a couple violin beetles in there. That's... Thanks, Kate. Ugh. Right, we're gonna drop all this stuff off and we will hit El Sacarino. Uh, anything else? Anything else? Anything else? Nope. Okay. It should. What's that? Island Millionaire. Does that earn 1 million coins? Very nice. Very nice. I like rare achievements. Pumpkin juice. I didn't check. It was worth 586. Watermelon jam. 287. Age sake. 3,174. That's nuts. That's nuts. That's the stuff I like seeing. I'm not going to lie to you. It should. Realistically. Oh. Um. I love you. Aw, oh, I thought she was going to ask about a kid. You're an amazing person. Do you know that? I feel like we're driven apart. What? Why would you say that? I'm trying to have babies with you. My lady, we're married. We're only driven apart because I, I can't realistically do anything with you. <laughs> we're not allowed to, like, hang out and do stuff together. <laughs> Don't blame me. Blame the confines of the video game. She just said all this nice stuff to me, and she's like, I feel like we're driven apart. It's like, ugh, please don't talk like that. That hurts. You're my fictional wife, and I really don't want fictional pain from my fictional wife. But no, uh, I keep interrupting myself. Uh, they should really have the the whole, like, have a kid option thing. Like, you should lay down one night, and then your wife's just like, Hey, you want to have a kid? 
You want to start a family? Like, I feel like that would that would be the best way to do it, is like... Quietly, at night. You two, in bed. Okay, we'll keep all the gold pumpkins. Sell that. Um, let's see, I'll take grapes. I'll put grapes up here. Alright, we gotta do some reorientating. Let's take you out of here. Put you down here. There we go. I want to keep like products with like products. It makes me happy. Seeing things all organized. I have a simple brain. So sick. We'll do. Yeah, 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 yeah. We can go. Quality product, large gold. Love to see it. Love to see it. This means there's a truffle in here somewhere, right? No? That's sad. Yeah, I'll come back and deal with you guys. We'll go hit the, uh,. The burbs first. Then we'll look into the auto feeder here. There's just so much going on. My brain is so um all over the place. I'm just hoping whenever the next big update comes out, it actually we get a more simultaneous release on uh between PC and console. Because, like, one of the issues is, is, like, I really hate it when a game comes to console, and they're like, oh, well, actually, it's, like, freaking six months behind, and then never actually gets caught up to the level of the PC. Which happens a lot. Uh, pay, uh, Payday 2, a game that, you know, I really enjoyed during its heyday. Um, suffered that problem. It never the the, like the Xbox and PlayStation edition. I, I don't. Maybe the PlayStation edition did, but the uh, Xbox never got to the same level as PC. And it's like, how how does a developer sit there and go like that's okay? Like how like I understand it's hard. Game development's hard, but like at the same time, it's like why would you want full parity between? all of your versions of the game, or are you just, you know, content with one person having more than another? It's like, that's super weird. All right, we're out of Amarins. Sprinklers still broken, by the way, uh, for anybody who is just wondering. Um, the hardwood forest is good. I wonder if the, if you guys are open it today. Oh, no, before I get distracted on another side quest, auto fe feeder. Three silver kelp essence. I might not have that. I don't even have one. So I need to go get some silver kelp. So guess what we're going to go do? We're going to get some more silver kelp. we got to go get some more. Because the auto feeder is going to be uh, such a big help. One of my big issues is is when um, winter hit the first time, even with just a couple animals uh, in the barn and in the uh, in the coop, it was frustrating because they like they will stand right on top of the feed and you can't move them, so you're just pretty much stuck having to deal with that. A hermit crab. Your sealed guy. So this will help uh, help us kill some time as we wait for the Halloween festival. I'm cool with that, honestly. We needed uh, needed something to help take up some time. That guy's moonwalking. Nope. We need uh. 
You need stuff to do. And, uh, because this game's sort of plot line is pretty short and can be completed very quickly, I feel like a lot of this game is you having to come up with your own sort of line of objectives for yourself. Hence why I've played this game slowly. I know, you know, my buddy, he, he blasted through this game, pretty much ate through all the content in no time flat, and I was just like, bruh. Like, this game's got a, a goodly amount of content, but, like, at the same time, it's like, you gotta... You gotta parse that stuff out, man. I'm not, uh... I'm not trying to run out of stuff to do, and... Inventory is full. All right. Looks like we are straight looking for silver kelp, which we've not found a lot of yet. Spawn rate is for the kelps. Feels like it should be a daily occurrence. Should uh, regrow, but dude, we are finding next to no silver, which is really bothersome. Just need enough for five silver kelp, man. That's all. See five five vessels. Which between what I have here and then I have back in my chest, I probably have enough. But let's let's get some more. So we have until 7 p.m. So we got a little bit more time to goof around. I just wish that the the trade off, like you need so much kelp per essence that the I don't feel like the trade off is uh, very good. Or the uh, conversion rate is kind of, kind of duke. That's, that's the word I was looking for. Okay. Dude, I'm pretty much gonna finish streaming today and just be dead. I'm gonna be just dead in the water, dude. Okay, we will call that enough. Not that I had a lot of energy to begin with, but I, there's like dishes and stuff that need to be done, dude, and like... They're my dishes. They're the ones I made, so... It's like shit. I gotta do my taxes still. I've been holding off on doing that. As soon as I don't want to. Because it's bloody annoying. Just a little bit more time, and we will be right as rain. These are all gold tier eye points, aren't they? Yeah. Uh. Oh shit! I forgot to check. Uh, one thing with this machine, yeah, it doesn't. They won't actually tell you it's done. I can tell it's done because, uh, you can't see the, uh, the truffle oil. I'm 
my eyes are watering. I gotta sneeze again. This is crap. Ugh. I might have to go blow my nose again, guys. It's not it's not fun. I am not having fun. <laughs> Ugh. Beetle dude, I walked right into that son of a bitch and didn't even notice it. Alright, seven. Start spooky festival. because some of the, the games kind of stink. Okay. Whoa, you look good. What about me? Do I look good? I dress up a little today. Spice things up. Can't come as a blacksmith, can I? That'd be so boring. Don't tell, uh, don't tell them this, but Dad's not good with scary things. That's why he hated the haunted house. All right, so they don't. Um, apparently, we do not have the Halloween costumes yet. The town get this many pumpkins. Did you supply them? Yeah, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> oh, cobblestone. Cute ghost decor. Bunch of just decorations. There's a ghost. To look for all the eyeballs too as we're walking around. Hi, Valentina. Hey, super fun. Mom and Auntie dressed up too. Okay, thank you. It goes on till late. I don't think I'll be brave enough to walk home alone. <laughs> Frank dressed up as himself. He's so boring. Uh, There's the giants. Heads up. Avoid Sam. I was talking to him earlier and he can't seem to stop complaining about the town code. I think he's had it with the mayor. So nobody's really saying anything. New and nobody's in any Halloween costumes, so. Try just. <laughs> Last time, some guy dressed up as a pair of freshmen here in university. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's just. Eh, nobody's got nothing new to say. I'm just gonna kind of avoid talking to anybody else. I thought they were gonna be in their costumes. Um. It's a little disappointing. Monk the skeleton. One of the rewards. The sus hammer again. I don't think I should hit the red one, should I? Okay, yeah, you can hit the. Don't hit the. Was it the green ones I'm not supposed to hit? One of these I was not supposed to hit. Round two. They still look like the green one with the candle was like. It was all evil looking. Yep. 
bastard. Stop me. Oh, hell yeah. Dang, Archie blew me out the water, bro. That's okay. Hey, only my 20 points. I don't really care about winning, winning right now because, like, I've already, like, done all this. They could have, and I believe they probably- Oh, that's such a good catch! Ew, it feeds by night, hunting with its venomous fangs. It's disgusting. Um, but that's good, because I needed that for the museum. I'm not gonna play that game. That game is, uh, dookie. So I'm not really interested in talking to anybody. Nobody- they're not, like, wearing their costumes or anything, so I don't really feel a compulsion to go run after each person. Um, scavenger hunt item. Well, we don't want to leave yet. There's another scavenger hunt item. Alright, yeah, so... I guess I misheard or misread one of the, um... Updates. It must be a future update that everybody gets their uh, Halloween outfits. Still rather disappointing. Rather disappointing. As I said, like, there's just some, just some stuff missing from this game that I feel like needs to be, you know. scavenger hunt either. Honestly, I, I did. Um, me being here and participating is the most important thing. I forgot how little there was to actually do during the spooky festival. Because, like, the only other thing you can really do is the ring toss. The ring toss is... Um, did I... How did I do with the ring toss last time? Might as well do it. Uh. I overshot that. Yay! That's an overshoot too. Hey, that actually counted. That was cool. You have to nail everything to even do anything there. Yeah, it stinks. Not their most well-developed uh, minigame. I will be... Most of the minigames in this are pretty fun. That one is that one is not my favorite. That one is not my favorite. Okay, I guess we'll get, the, get out of here. I forgot there was very little to do here, and everybody's just saying the same stuff again. Hey, oh, I got a pink diamond. Scavenger hunt item. Now, 
I think I need a pink diamond for the, uh, for up here at the Lake Temple, actually. I think I need that for up here. That's... No, it is not under precious gems. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Yeah, you can't go back to the town because the event's still technically going on. Alright, guys. We are gonna just wrap her on up. Oh, I forgot. Oh, the tarantula does not go where you think it goes. It goes to the museum. Already well, donated that. So I don't need to send that to the museum. Equipment or is that farming? I have a pink diamond. I already have a pink diamond actually. Huh. Well, we streamed for nearly four hours today. I'm about a hundred percent cooked right now. Attended the Spooky Day Festival. Valentina. Cool. Yes! My parents think we could just close the inn for winter. Baby time! So, uh, that's a cool note to leave off on. So, we got the house upgraded. We got, we're gonna be having babies. Um, and, uh, we have. Given enough to the temple that we've unlocked the hardwood forest. We also found like a monkey king sitting over there. It's a big old orangutan just chilling. Uh, we found that. That's pretty cool. Don't know what that does yet. Uh, but yeah. We achieved more today than I anticipated. We've also went probably nearly an hour past uh, where I thought I was going to go. But I really wanted to get that done. We're in the winter now though. We finished up fall and uh, we're in the winter. So, it's very exciting. It's very cool. We got a lot done. I'm uh, quite happy. Stick around. We will do more Coral Island next Sunday. Uh, as I said, it's just going to be relegated to Sundays right now. Uh, I don't want to burn myself out on the game because, one, uh, the winter is a very boring season. And it's just... It just takes a little while to get through winter. Uh, we'll do all the, the underwater stuff. We'll finish up with the coral and all that stuff underwater. Um, we'll do all that. And then we're just going to focus on pro pretty much upgrading all of our tools, doing all that stuff. So we'll have stuff to do. We'll get everything up to Osmium and whatever and whatnot. We'll, we'll have a good time. But it'll be it'll be pretty, pretty boring, pretty quiet. But that is okay. So make sure you leave a like and make sure you are subscribed. We have a lot of stuff coming up. We're going to be playing a bit of Greedfall this week. Um, I'm going to try to get in a couple of streams of Greedfall. And then on Friday, we're starting uh, Banishers, Ghosts, and New Eden. We're starting a brand new game. Uh, new to the channel. Came out in uh, February. So we'll be playing that. I'm really excited to play that. The game looks fantastic. So you guys have a good Easter. Or just a good Sunday in general. So hope to catch you guys soon. Take it easy.